it. With Jack, I'm really happy that I'm not the only one that plays a mobile game as much as you do. I, dude, I'm what mobile game are you playing? It's Assassin's Creed Rebellion. Dude, you yeah. sucker. Like, it's you try it's, to suck it's up as much. Oh, dude, you sucker. It's a time <laughs> suck. Wow. It's like how much doo doo like, can I, you do do? I've, I've done I've done everything in it already. <laughs> Who do you do do, bitch? <laughs> Hey, welcome. It's off topic. There's a number attached there somewhere. We're all here. You know the gist. I'm Michael. We got Jeff, Alfredo, Jack, Jeremy. Way over there. Because so Alfredo away. was like, sit over way there. Way over there, Ami. Yeah, yeah, dude. Have you ever sat there before? I've sat here a couple of times. Uh, and why? But not since I've lost weight. So now I don't have to worry about I my gut. Don't. Oh, that's, much. Yeah, that's I don't. Yeah. Right here. These are, these are gut spots. I don't sit here if you got well, a fat gut. Yep. My gut. Only fat that makes sense. Only the fat guys okay. sit right here. All right. Just that actually makes sense. Right? Fatties. You, as Alfredo's <laughs> right sucking here. down Oreos. Behind this. He's got mini Oreos. Yeah. He's eating them right now. <laughs> I fucking, I fired in this morning. So, hey, Rebecca. Yeah. I fired in this I morning. So, hey, Sergeant. I fucking fired in this morning. Super excited because. I accidentally lost two more pounds, so I uh -huh. weigh 162. So I was gonna tell Jeremy, like, You're hey, dying, we're tied. You gotta I don't want to lose any more weight. Like, I, I don't want to lose Eat any some more weight. Oreos, yeah. fatty sucking. And down. I'm not gonna do that. Dude, but I just came from having a burrito. This, this little, is my dessert. Yep. This little twink right here, he weighs 161 now. 161. Yeah. Well, that's because he's getting he slammed one lately. Pound skinnier he's trying not to get slammed so much. I By go the way, home and throw up just. Out of shame of myself, yeah. But because you choose to. Because I choose to. Uh, this episode is sponsored by Quib and Devil May Cry 5. But also, don't forget our lovely beer sponsor. They're not doing Dropping it. the fucking ball. Our beer ball. sponsor, we're, we're, Voodoo Ranger. Yeah. Your part, it's more of a partnership all year. Yeah, yeah it's Nothing not like foods. this particular show is sponsored by Voodoo Ranger or anything like that. It's just like... I'm getting Voodoo, Voodoo Ranger Rangers tattooed on my back. Achievement yeah. Hunter is sponsored by Voodoo Ranger. Yeah. Somebody just called it <laughs> Alfredo and Jack Team Fat Boys. <laughs> <laughs> One of my favorite like lines it. from Team Jack Fat ever. Boys <laughs> are back. <laughs> Let's get Alfredo. And you know, they can never be wet. Jack just looks it up right and goes, you better not take my fat He said that to me, too. That's my thing. Oh, my God. He said that to me when I was pushing, when I was getting near 200. Jack pulled me aside yeah, and was like, like, hey, stop. Hey, some dude down. named it's SSK my, my something or other said he just sponsored, and this is his very first time watching oh, live. So sweet. welcome to Thanks. the family, buddy. Welcome. Now, you, I, I hope it's not you. a huge disappointment to Now, I will say, I will say about the fat thing, yes, I'm fat. I understand that. I get that. You had a hair. Oh, you, you had a hair. <laughs> I thought he was using it. Jedi oh, powers. Oh, that one, that, that, that you need to take care of. You got a oh, straight beard hair. Yeah, it's it's like, it's a I, 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 I would like got my hair cut. You got a honky hair. I would got my hair cut, but they yeah, left the terrible. front long and my beard longer. Anyway. They trim um, beard. I get my hair cut tomorrow. I go to, going away. So it, it doesn't look like it, but I go to the gym three days a week. I, I hit the treadmill. I'm running. Does that to pick Katie up? No, I mean physically. I'm running I'm running 15 miles a week. And so, but I haven't changed my diet at all. So that's awesome, dude. Like health wise, I'm actually pretty good, but I'm still fat. <laughs> to be fair, only 90% of the work. Yeah, well, if, if you want to lose yeah. weight. If you want to lose weight. If you want to do anything. <laughs> Heart's feeling <laughs> good. Got some muscle. I just got some fat. So. Dude, muscle, weight like, loss, yeah, like, damn. diet. It's too that's much. That's fine. If you have, if you have like, <laughs> a lot of muscle uh, underneath uh, That's too. awesome. That's good, because then you've got yeah. weight to throw around. That's the thing. Then I, I, got, I got momentum right now. <laughs> yeah. So. So wrecking ball. Anyway, but if anyone wants to, if you want to go run a 5K right now, I bet I could, I could probably beat... Maybe a, you. A, I'm more than half of you guys at a watch here right now. I'm willing to bet. You Fredo should probably take me. Recreationally I, he's been running three miles a day. That's for true. Two years. I do do that. Now. How much? How I much is a five k? It's three point one two miles. I think he's fine. How, how, how long does it take for you to run three miles? Uh, Seven minutes. Depends on. Uh, it's like anywhere from like twenty five to thirty minutes, probably. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Be, it just depends on what setting I'm on. Yeah. The treadmill. That's fine. Or what I'm watching. I'll beat you <laughs> in the five k. I'll run you over. If what I'm watching has <laughs> has ended and I don't want to get up and go adjust my laptop because it's just my laptop plugged into the TV, like I don't want to get up. Like the autoplay is coming up and it's a video I don't want to watch. I'm like fuck, I gotta increase the speed so I can be done faster. That's what I do. Now I do. Oh. I watch three episodes of uh, Parks and Rec. I'm going through. I'm, I, I'm on season three right now. That might be the next thing I do. What, honestly, what I do is channel. like because I do. I do an hour. You do an hour, five minutes. It's an hour of, of like running like back and forth, different speeds, and then a five minute cool down. So three episodes is sixty six minutes. So if I start it right as I begin, I get through three episodes and I'm done. I do. And it goes uh, by fast. RT cut short. I watch a lot of those. Mm -hmm. It's like kind of best bits of Rooster Teeth, so I'll like watch those every now and again. Just catch up on productions I don't normally watch. And then, what else do I watch? I, watch I just else don't work out. What Culture Wrestling, they yeah, keep we know. me up to date on wrestling stuff. i watch that. So, anyway. But yeah, I'm fat. I saw you working on... <laughs> working and that's it. Alfredo was working on some barbecue yesterday. Oh, <laughs> where? From where? Yeah. What, what is it? No, no Southside. Southside, Southside, Southside Market. Southside Market. I was working on yeah. some racks and ribs. It's, it's in Elgin. It's it's sausage, sausage, had cheese and jalapeno in it. Yeah, we did. Do a Rooster Teeth 5K. We I, I found uh, that barbecue place when we were shooting um, 
the first laser team because that we did like so many night shoots. There was one day where we like, there's hair everywhere. Yeah. We stayed at a at like a hotel because we had like five hours off, and then we had to go right back to shooting, and it was like way out over there. And uh, <clears throat> spent the night, woke up, and it was like we had like an hour before we had to go back to Man. set. And I was like, "What's nearby?" And that barbecue oh. place is nearby. And I was like, "This shit's fucking." Good. Where's that pirate? Unholy guardian that rum bets. I have a oh, nice. Oh, it's at my desk. Oh, oh right. so let, me get, let me get let me get let me get Yeah, someone so, in his rum Steffi, this week. get someone else. It's not under bar. Is Steffi here? It's not. Under, it's I mean, if she's not here, she's watching. <laughs> oh, there you are. Hey, uh, Michael got rum Will you in Awu this to week get it for us. It's it's called it's pi it's pirate p y r a t. If you could grab that, please. Thank you, Steffi. Just use your authority to make someone else do it. Because we all respect you, Steffi. I was gonna pop open that. Yeah. I told Michael I was gonna fire off today. I don't know why. You told me on like fucking Monday. I was like, let's get drunk on all Monday or Tuesday. Jeremy was like, yo, let's get drunk. And then we had a funny conversation about it today, right? Uh, so like Monday or Tuesday, he was like, dude, Friday, let's just fucking drink on off topic. And I went, eh, maybe. I was like, it's been so. I was like, I just did on the spot. Work is and got work. bad. Yeah. Um, so then I'm like, okay, whatever. And then Lindsay went to a bridal shower today. So she's not here today. So I told Jeremy, I'm sitting there. I was like, man, fuck. I was like, <sighs> I, wanna, I don't know if I can go to town today. Cause then, like, I gotta get a ride home. I gotta call like a lift or whatever. And Jeremy goes, "What are you going to town for?" I was like, "I'm not physically going to town, Jeremy. I'm talking about drinking on the podcast. I'm not going to town on alcohol." I was like, "Oh, I you were saying you were going downtown." I was going to town. Fun. I'm going to town, Jeremy. Like that sounds fun. <laughs> and then and then he goes, he's like, ah, well you go to town if I drive you home. And I'm like, if I go to town, you're not gonna you're enjoying yeah, driving. Yeah, I know. I thought I'd offer. I can give you guys lift. You are close to me. I mean Jeremy is I know, I just don't want somebody else to do it. That is watch true. If you're throwing Dude, Taco Bell in all right. After 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 the live podcast we did, man, Katie uh Katie drove my car and or dr drove me home and we went to McDonald's and I was just Cat was with you. That yeah. was a fun oh, that's right. podcast. Was was Cat with me? Yeah, I was. She I was, I was almost drowning and in a like tub. Like went back or something, right? <laughs> <laughs> I was no, no, nearly no. underwater no, no, no. in a full tub. No, Kat, <laughs> Kat took you home because then we yeah. went. We went and got Gatorade for you because you were gone. Kat's yeah. like, "Can you help me not let Jeremy die?" Correct. So we went to Walgreens, and got like electrolytes for you. <laughs> Meanwhile, I was hammered, and Katie didn't give a shit about me. She was more concerned about you. Well, I was like <clears> beyond. And we went to McDonald's, and I was yelling people through the drive-through. <laughs> but nice. Yeah. So that was nice. I was, I was hammered, but I was like, "There's so much yelling." No, I've going, never been quiet hammered. That was fun. That far gone on a shoot, dude. Your next day was. Oh, oh there we go. That's us at McDonald's. Off. Look, how, look how happy Katie is. The next photo. day is. When, I mean, we've talked about this before, but the next day is when we flew to Philly for uh, Haunter, and yep. Jeremy had the worst flight of his life. Oh, that's right. Throughout three times. <laughs> I heard flying. about that. Yeah. He was Holy like a fucking because yeah. you guys corpse. had like a like five or six a.m. flight, right? Yeah, it was early. Ooh. Yeah, but I did a thing too where I woke up and I was like, you know, so I woke up at about four thirty. Yeah, my alarm set to or somewhere like there, and I felt fine. I was like, oh my god, like thank God, I'm I'm feeling all right, and uh, you, you know, drunk. got everything together <laughs> and got in the car with Cat, and she drove me to the airport, and like on the way to the airport, I was like, I'm not good. Like I could feel my stomach like. Oh. So then, like I got into the Admirals Club. Ryan was already in there, and I was talking to him for a bit, and I was like. If you need me, I'll be in the bathroom. I just like went to the bathroom. I was just like threw up in the Admiral's oh. like in the bathroom. Yeah, oh. Jeff and I got there, met Ryan, and like 20 minutes went by. And I was like, is Jeremy dead? And Ryan's like, I'm getting a little concerned. Then you came out, you were out for a minute, and then you went back in. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> like, yeah. Are you guys What's still up? there? All right, call and run back. And then they were eating great looking cheesesteaks. Like, you know, I'm feeling like shit. And the hotel's like an hour away from the airport. Like, we, we had to drive there in our rental car. And Damn. Jeff's like, let's go get cheesesteaks. Like, let's drive into town. We'll go get cheesesteaks and blah. And I'm just like, you know, I don't want to be like, please, no, no don't yeah. do that, right? Yeah. And I'm like, I'm like, go, you guys gotta go, like, you know, go. And like, so I just sat in the car. Michael brought a sick bag with him off the plane because he wasn't feeling great either. No, I brought it for you. Did you really? Yeah. Oh, thank you. I wasn't feeling good. I thought you said good. you weren't feeling great. I either. wasn't feeling good, but there was there was one point on the plane where I was like, oh fuck, I might throw up. But I was out the window. I didn't want to move everyone. Yeah. So I was just resolved to like, either I'm gonna hold it in or I'm gonna throw up in this bag. And then I didn't, and I was over it, and that was it for the whole thing. And then I brought it, I saved it for you. So Michael had the bag, so I just took the bag and sat in the van that we were in, <laughs> with my head in the bag like this. And I just sat there the entire drive to the Jeez. to the cheesesteak place. We got to the cheesesteak place, I threw up in like next to a building. You just threw up on some buildings Dude, a get, bunch of times. I yeah. get pretty bad motion sickness, and there was one time on a plane, I think it was during us. no, maybe it was like last year's RTX when we did uh, London. 
where I was sitting there and I was just like, I, I can't do this. And there's no throw up bag. So I like got to the point. I was like, what are my options here? And yeah. I was like, well, my hoodie's hood. <laughs> oh, oh, no, you don't want to do that. <laughs> so I sat there and I was like, Damn. I'm going to keep it to my side. I throw up in my shirt that's over a worst, my hoodie. Yeah. I was like, that's really? the worst case scenario. Tons of shirts. How many hoodies you bring in? It's true. That's like one time I... Like, I was. It was uh, a Jeff hoodie. I was like, I'll get another. They gotta take it off. Oh, there's no more Jeff hoodies. I. Uh, there's right. a new Jeff. That Jeff yeah, sweater. Right. I grabbed one of those for Katie. That that. New that you Jeff. took one? No, I I got it through the store. What was it? The new. It's like the the long sleeve sweater just came out like this week. Oh it was yeah. Like, I got I got one of those the balloon shirts, the yellow one. I got one of those for me. Just hit me. Uh, just hit, hit me up with about thirty bucks. We'll be good. I already got it. I already paid for it, man. <laughs> you pay me credit. Well, you know what else uh, you got? That's sold out now. Oh yeah, yeah. The uh, yeah. the pride shirts came out this week, so this is the the Achieve Hunter pride shirt. So I think they're I think they're all officially sold out now, like all of the pride merch we have. But I'm pretty sure we're doing another run of it. So and um, yeah, it's, they're really cool. Yeah, and it's cool, and it's also portions of the of the uh, proceeds from the shirts go to a local Austin uh, uh, out charity. I forget the name. Is it? Uh, uh, does anyone know it off the top of their head? It's like out youth, I think maybe. Out youth. Out, out youth. youth. Yeah. So, um, yeah. Anyway, that's super cool. You said what you said. Back yeah, to I, I, they don't know for sure. I was pretty. I'm pretty yeah. sure I knew what it was. Oh, there we go. So here, here's all of them up here. If you want to see, there's a people like people shirt that's really cool. I like that one a lot. I like the Ruby one like people shirt. The Funhouse one is actually really, really cool. It, yeah. Yeah, it's all right. It looks like the Dick House logo. Kind of. Yeah. Yeah, the Ruby one's cool. And the off-topic logo looks real nice too. Thanks yeah. for uh, putting that back up on the screen. We yeah, well, let's listen. <laughs> okay, you're wearing the shirt. Let's, you know. Yeah. Anyway, they're, I'm let's pretty sure. I'm pretty sure they'll, they will be back in the stores pretty quick. Yeah, they're I think ordering more. They knew they were, there was going to be a lot of anticipation for them. They didn't realize how much, how much, how excited you guys were for them. So we will see more. Jeff, what are we saying about the Celtics? Uh, Did they win. They were that, they were tied up, right? Playing tonight. How many are they up two one or no? It's one one. Okay. Who are they playing in the series? Who are the Celtics Bucks. playing? Yeah. They're playing the Milwaukee Bucks. They destroyed in game one. They got destroyed in game two. Game three will be in Boston. We'll see. Yeah. Is it it's best been of seven or best of five? Best of seven. Best seven. It's okay. been an interesting playoff so far, but I also know that nobody in the audience gives a shit about sports. So that one guy did. There's a they couple of sports. Yeah. There's some like there's there's some like stragglers from sports ball that probably float around. They, yeah, yeah. Else to they don't know where to live. You know what I mean? They have nowhere to go, so they cling to any little bit they of sports information. And they eat up the two minutes of yeah. basketball talk. Well, it's true. I mean, the last time, so always uh, 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 always open had Mia on. They got a million view <coughs> video. They got a million view episode. So they started sports ball again with Mia, and then now we got the million view one with Ray. So we're gonna bring back sports ball for the third time, and Ray's gonna be the host. Oh, yeah. And then it's gonna get Man, canceled. Man, you shouldn't say that. Yeah, People will believe it. Uh, no, oh no, they won't, Jeff. They're smart. So I'm, <laughs> I'm kidding. I can already hear broadcast. Hey, you know what? Going, on, on, oh, oh, on, too soon. Too soon. On the sports trend, uh, Raw and SmackDown weren't great this week. I just thought I'd fill you in on that. <laughs> Ron what? Smackdown? Raw. WWE. WWE. I saw his name is Raw. I thought he said Raw. Ron Smackdown. I thought he Ron said Raw. I thought he was talking about a man named Ron Smackdown. Why didn't you have someone else? Thank you. He invented Smackdown. You didn't say Ron Smackdown. You said Raw and Smackdown. I heard Raw and Smackdown. Oh, I didn't know. I was, I was like, like I must be with. behind. I don't know. I didn't there's have a Ron <laughs> Smackdown guy. He sounds cool. So so there 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 no yeah, I thought Ron Smackdown was a Parks and Rec this, thing. This, uh... Somebody sent us this on Awu. We opened it on camera. I don't know if it's the one. I haven't smelled it. I don't it's know if it's, it's is, is it the one that comes out next week? It's the one we just yeah, shot. It's, it's the one coming out on okay. Sunday. So I, I don't it's know. Got if the, a bad oh, stink, but there's a good, good. There's good dude. Stink. It's so satisfying. Wait, hang on. Wait, wait, hang on. Okay. Ready? Ooh, oh, that's that's good. Good. Yeah, there's a that's, good stink ooh. under it. There's a vanilla. That's what it sounds like when I. That's some good smell around right there. That's what. That's what it sounds like on the rare occasion when I get far enough in, Gavin. It's like, oh, nice. Far enough in. It's weird if you. All right, well, the air hole just popped out. Does he have like a like you, a his, his asshole like a suction cup? Uh, you know, so it like it grabs it like it's one of those assholes that like out. you put your saw, finger in it pulls you it's in like deeper. It's like a Chinese finger trap. I saw yeah. once yeah. we sat down, Jeremy had a bang and an empty shot glass, and I was like, oh, here we go. There you go. <laughs> just bang. Oh yeah, man. That's I'm gonna, that's, I'm gonna that's gonna why WWE is also on my mind because every time someone's and I've said it in the office a bunch, but anytime someone says bang, I think about. Someone's entrance music, which starts with just him yelling "bang." I Diamond Dallas Page saw a funny comment on uh, the roulette's play that just came out. We did Graw two. Oh, that came out, and that was fun. Graw two, <laughs> yeah, Graw, gear, uh, uh, Ghost Recon, Advanced Ghost Warfare two, Graw, Graw, Graw. Oh, Graw. oh, you guys played Graw two? Yeah, it was yeah. a roulette's play. You were you don't oh, like playing Jeff games? Oh, Jeff wasn't in it. Remember? That's right. It's one of my favorite he games. Of all like, time. He doesn't like playing games. We'll pull it again. We'll pull it again. All so right. we'll pull it. 
Well, Jeff hey, would have done what listen, I would have Jer- done. Jeremy knows some people. We'll pull it again. Yeah. Or Ooh. we'll just do a Let's Play in it. Uh, it was who? It was me, Ryan. Alfredo, and me. You really, like, me? Like, you weren't sure. What was it? I think I was there. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you were, because you were in first person. Um, that's right. Oh. Yeah. Did you yeah, realize we were like, at one point I looked over Why? Jeremy's screen, I'm like, oh, you're playing first per- person. And he was like, is, is there another option? I'm like, yeah, we're all in third. That's most of the game is played in third. And he was like, what? Yeah. And it was weird. You actually, there's no button. You have to go into the option menu. And like, so start options. Old way. school. Yeah, yeah, weird. But anyway. Um, you know, it's oh, probably yeah. one of those things where, well, on the 360, you could set your preferences for games and then it would auto apply them to certain oh, games. Oh, yeah, if maybe they, it was. If they, like, was adhere to that. Those are time, yeah. I, uh, yeah, that's a lot. Awesome. I, uh, but anyway, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. Why do people keep saying I'm sad? Shot. He's fine. Leave, I'm, my, leave the fucking guy alone. I'm the time of my life. Shut the hell up. Leave him alone. What a right? life. I'm looking at the chat. Calm down. People say I'm staring off into the distance. People say that about me all the time. I'm reading your comments. I might not be saying it, but I'm reading them. I'm taking it in and I'm ignoring them. There's fucking four other people talking right now. I can't. No, no, no. Yeah. So yeah. anyway, I saw a fucking comment, uh, and oh, it was like, it. it was like, you know, all the times that I heard them talk about <clears throat> Graw, like I've never knew what kind of game it was, and I just thought it was a wrestling game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like Monday Night Graw. <laughs> this is making me laugh. <laughs> Then Jeremy and I got on the subject of wrestling, and then he started looking up botch jobs, and we were watching wrestling botches. Yeah, botches. Of like, so it's called like, when you mess up a movie. The one yeah. we were, oh, the one yeah. we, I don't is remember it, how we got on like topic. Is it like bad, like someone breaks an arm or something? No, or? no. What happened, no, 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 we were talking okay. about when somebody fucks up the move, but then the other person just goes with okay. it. And still oh, they, they just go like, when the person didn't hit them at all, and they yeah. just go Dude, like Dude, this great one was like, people, um, I think there was a match between, uh, I think a guy named Kalisto, I think it was Kalisto in there, and then, um, some other huge. Is Eric here? No, he had a fucking meeting. Oh, what a piece of shit! I know, I shit on him, right? Ryback. He, he was, was walking out. Police on Ryback, and so Ryback's Ooh. this huge guy, like. Yeah. Yep. And Dude, Ryback, cheers. Gigantic. Are you guys saying huh. Gygax? Gary Gygax wrestles now? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You take out, he takes out his dice. Oh, oh right? that's, that's got a right. Did I get that right? Yeah, that's a you got it. You got that in dragons. He, he created guy. Dungeons and Dragons. So. Got it. I right. liked the initial of that. The after was not great. Really, I didn't like any of it. Um. So, anyways, <laughs> Ryback, huge guy. Kalisto, very small guy. He's like a yeah, uh, like a Jeremy Luchador. Oh. And so he goes, jumps on the top rope, slips. Ryback's outside the ring. He sees Kalisto slip, who's supposed to jump up onto him. So Ryback runs forward to the ring. So that Kalisto will fall on him, so he can catch him and not let him fall. So he falls. Ryback catches him and goes, and then like falls to the ground, like he got nailed by a move. It's such an awesome thing. But he like saves Kalisto yeah. and then looks like he gets. That's in. cool. Still though. goes with. He it. made the best out of a bad situation. He did. Wrestling yeah. ain't easy, man. Like pimping. It's not. Pimpin's probably easier than wrestling, I'll be honest. Uh, Professional wrestling. It's a bit different, I would think. It's, it's di- yeah, I mean, different. I mean, pressures, different athletically, yeah. athletically. Pimpin, yeah. Pimpin's easier. a mental game. Pimpin is a um, mental game. There's your title of your episode right there. It's a good one. I mean, it is, though. Oh, man. So, there's that human I'm being. experiencing something interesting oh, this week. Wow. What is that, Jeffrey? That's an odd shaped human. So, I moved, right? Moved. I, uh, I bought a new house. Are you in? You're good. I'm in. I'm in. I'm all moved in. You fired up yet? I, so the funny, I, want it. I have the funny thing that's going on that oh. happens when you move to a new house. Everything, is everything broke. Everything broke. I've been out of the office all week dealing with like in this in this week, at different points in Got time. Off. My fridge, my oven, Two. my dryer, my dryer broke too. My shower. Did you? Are you sure you bought a house? And something else broke. Kidney. So my hot water project. heater broke. Oh, wow. <laughs> um, <laughs> Fix well, everything's fixed now except for my sh- my dryer doesn't have a steam function and my fridge no! doesn't have an ice what cream. Your, your pizza it? oven doesn't have a pizza. They have them, they just don't work right now. But everything else is fixed. It's been a stress week. But that's not what I want to talk about. The cool thing about moving that I have forgotten about because I've lived, you know, when you get to be as old as I am, you live in places for a long time. Uh, or like I was living in the house, you know, that Griffin and Millie and I lived in and then I moved and I got a condo and it was close enough so I, it wasn't like a new area. It was a little bit further in. Uh, but I live in a new neighborhood. I've lived in Austin 25 years. I just moved to this new neighborhood. It's like living in an entirely different city. Yeah. Different Home Depot, different Lowe's, different grocery stores, different stores, neighbors restaurants, different, 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 restaurants to to. different neighbors I've already started to ignore. I've given them some hard <laughs> ignoring. They're not taking the hint. They're being very friendly. I'm not into it. <laughs> I'll so do. And, uh, 
And they just always just like coming over in the yard and talking and saying you hi and stuff. Like, hey, hey, neighbor just goes. Yeah, yeah, Everybody comes yeah. in the habit like, inside his house, just leaves. Dude. Like, well, I'm Paul. And I'm like, cool, I'm Jeff. And as you can see, I'm unloading my car, so I'm going to get back to that. But uh, you continue to be Paul, I guess. I'm going to. Yeah. I don't want to. Go be to Paul you. over there. Yeah. Oh. I'm friendlier with people at my gym than that live next to me because at least I have an out. Yeah. Right? Well, like, I'm at the gym and I'm like, <laughs> I got I got to work out though. And they're like, oh, okay. And then I leave. Also, the temple. It's My just, house, I live there. I actually like being friendly with the people near me. Except, yeah. But I can't with the dog, dog people. Dog yeah. people. Yeah. You make the it. Dog you, people make you it. You inspire hard, other man. people to try to talk to me. It's yeah. just crazy that, like, I've lived in Austin for 25 years and I feel like I'm in San Francisco. Yeah. Like, it's totally different. But less It's neat. cool, though. Yeah. It is cool. It's neat. That was awesome. And I, it turns out, Pricey. like, a lot of the shit that I, like, my haunts and places that I liked, like, I had a Home Depot I went to. I used to have a Lowe's that I would go to. When you move to a new place, you get a lot of Home Depot and Lowe's for a short period of time. Yeah. Uh, new HEB, you know, Ab. like figuring out the new grocery stores and stuff. Turns out all the things that, like the part of town I'm in, I thought was for like Sucky, that's just way better. I've been going to the wrong shit for 25 <laughs> years. Yeah. The HEBs are fucking awesome where I am. There's some, there's some nice HEBs in Austin. We got the, the one HEB, by the way, it's a grocery store. If you're not in, yeah. if you're not from Texas, so HEB is our yeah. big grocery store. I, I, like, like, I ain't never like heard of it until I moved here. Or ShopRite. Or Randall's or ShopRite. Or Food World. Like going Del to ShopRite. Or... I went on a rant about the can-can sale a week or so ago. You see fucking Tyler Stab bragging in chat. Think Dennis and Mac moved to the suburbs. What's he bragging about? That he worked at WWE. Hey, Stab, shut Good the fuck for up. you. Good shut for up. you. Oh, man. You yeah. want my mom to send your dad some more shirtless photos of me? Calm yeah, down. <laughs> Calm down. I got to know. It goes around, all right? I got to um, send her pictures and be like, don't send this to Stab's dad. No, we, we talked about that because like, Katie and I are kicking around the idea of Sick. moving. Photos and I, are getting around. I, right, I love the idea of starting fresh. Like, I'm kind of jealous of you. Yeah. That you've, got, yes. you've got an empty slate Lock and you can number. do whatever you want with it. And that, that to me, like right now, like I love my house. But we're looking to maybe move closer to town and stuff. And but if I could oh, right he now, he is going to town. Like he's leaving me. I am going to town. He's going to town. But if we could like reset right now and basically have our house completely empty, and I'd re put everything back it's in, I would have done it all differently it's and would have made it so much more efficient. And, it's and I kind of I'm like sort of jealous that you get to do that. It's been it's been cool. It's all how you look at it too. Like when I moved from the house that you I move. you know that Millie was born in that I lived at for 13 years. My house. Person, I'll say my house. It was like. I couldn't. A house across the street from Guys, can you shut the hell up? Sorry. Jeff's talking. Griffin was very fairly like, you should take take half of everything. You know, take all the stuff you want, take the furniture you want, whatever. We'll make it work. And I just couldn't do it. Like, yeah. I remember I she had just bought me this new like seventy two inch TV or seventy inch TV for my birthday, and I took it off the wall, and there was a giant hole there where it had been, and I just couldn't. This is two years ago. Like no. physically, you couldn't carry it. No, I <laughs> oh, yeah, but physically, I just I couldn't. I couldn't take it. You're like, so what I do I just, do with this I, metaphor? I just couldn't diminish the home that Millie grew up in in any way. So I left with basically nothing but a sofa. I get that. And a, and a mattress I got from work. I get that. Because I told I told Lindsay, like, if we ever split, like, I'm taking everything. <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely. Just to make it even. Like, it's but, all coming. You get Yeah, nothing. I told Kat, I'll <laughs> take all the stuff. She can me. have the cat. And you didn't tell her it nothing. It could be even. very depressing. I told her, please don't leave me, dear God. <laughs> but it's all, in, I guess it's all in your frame of mind. It's like you're talking about, like, nothing I own is two, over two years old now. Yeah. You know? And it's kind of fun. It's like reinventing. Yourself. Yeah, it's like resetting. Yeah, yeah it's really, it is actually, really. If you get an opportunity to do it, and life allows you to do it, it's a fun. Yeah, it's a, it gets a fun exercise. I, I catch I'm, my, really, uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna leave here. Bring it with Jackie. Start new. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Heard it here first. Someone tweeted Jackie right now. Uh, uh, yeah, it's a revelation. Give her the, give her the Jeff, up. like imp embedded the seed. That's Try some new stuff, knows. man. Yeah. No, because that's that's, right. the, that's the one issue. Alfredo, don't make me choose. That's that's the one issue is Don't when you have a house, you start collecting stuff, and yeah. you just like you just look up and like I have a ton of shit now. <laughs> like I've got a closet full of shirts, and what I've been doing is I've got those vacuum seal bags. Yeah, I'll go through and pull like fifty shirts, throw them in a vacuum seal, and seal it up. And I'm like, if I don't touch any of these in six months, I'm just gonna get rid of them all. You're I, I am in a similar situation where the, I've made so much goddamn Jeff merch, yeah, I can't throw away my own stuff. You didn't make it, and we've made so much Jeff merch. I'm <laughs> uh, toiling away. Throw <laughs> away. Well, I mean, I'm very, I mean, you, a hey, lot to do. Hey, with. you said yes. Yeah, I said draw that, and I said no, draw it better, different. Yeah. And I said mm, make it blue, and I went okay. This is how you get um, Deramid, all right? Calm down. Just don't. But I have like to get a hundred Jeff items. Yeah, that yeah. are just like I have a closet Someone full of Jeff. I'm not gonna many. wear. Well, ha most of it's large. I, I swim in it now. Yeah. But like I can't throw it away because I have like a complete collection. So I need maybe I should do that. I should feel bad it because I'm never gonna <laughs> freeze it. They're awesome. Just get rid of the largest. <laughs> I'm gonna freeze it like Ted Jeff, Williams' brain. I will say, like I got so I got those vacuum sealed bags, and I got one for um, when I travel. It's like when I travel mm -hmm. internationally, you put all your clothes in there and fucking seal. My it girlfriend up. does it that. It shrinks it down. Yeah, it's but like, what oh. happens when you open 
in it when you're traveling. You take it. You've got it's got a travel one. You bring it. Oh, with you bring you. it with. Yeah, you. yeah. You bring okay. a little travel thing. Like, with then you. that means you you're it. fucked. Once so you, you get, get like a little travel thing. It's about the size of a phone. It's got a little tube. You plug it in. Just like let it go for about five minutes. <laughs> Jeremy's losing. <laughs> that. Jeremy's losing. It. What's up? If Fredo wants some fat white boyfriend, he can hit me up. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Mike. Uh, that was right, we Derek C. We don't know. Was Chef Mike. We don't know where he's going yet, but anyway, let you know. Yeah. Vacuum seal bags. Look him up. Look them up. Good stuff. Look them up. <laughs> They've been around for a while. <laughs> They're fucking new. Brand new invention. Elon Musk just made them. They're awesome. Go to a fucking tailor with my $20 t-shirts. Yeah. I'd like to have all of my two-year-old stretched out t-shirts tailored, please. Jack isn't yeah. telling you he's endorsed by Vaxac Pro. That's true. Vaxac. Uh, <laughs> Thomas Zachville Zach. Pro promo code Jack at VaxacPro.com and you'll get 10% off your order. Anyway. I know Make Jeff quote, served Jeff. in the army as a photographer, but does anyone know if he deployed? Either way, Jeff, if you see this, thank you for your service from one vet to another. Oh, thank you for your service. Oh, he's sir, veterinarian. Madam. That's cool. Uh, I up. deployed <laughs> America. <laughs> I was I was on average deployed eight months out of the year for the five years I was in the army. I all I did was deploy. This guy. It sucked. Where'd you go? You went to Afghanistan, Iraq. Not that I'm allowed to talk about. Ooh. No, I went to um. That's what? your doing. Oh, God. That's your it's fucking Banksy. Doing. What the hell? Banksy. It's What's Banksy. It's Banksy. Doing. It got shredded. It That's fell you, Jeremy. Out of the frame. It's yeah, because out remember the when Jeremy frame. walked over and fucking banged the frame and it fell down and I'm put it back saying. up. And I don't think Michael was actually on the podcast at that point. One, I don't remember it. Two, I bet Jeremy doesn't remember it. it no, I do. It, it was, was. I think it was the last podcast where you joined late. He went to go get pieces of uh, I, I went to go get a paper, paper towel, towel. Oh, oh, you're talking about and I pulled that and then the whole thing went <laughs> When we were getting fucked in the anus by the derp crew Yes Yeah, yeah, yeah so uh, well, You said fucked in the anus and I was trying to remember Mario which Kart. topic Mario Kart, Kart. Um, That was cool though, it was a total Banks job Yeah, yeah it really it was It would have been shredded, that would have been great That was a boss Why job. didn't we get a shredder there? Eric? Yeah. Eric? He's in a yeah. meeting, fuck him Somebody um, <laughs> Oh, what were you going to say? Right. Uh, somebody was saying oh, that we on. should nice vac thing, our sacks though. and see what happens oh, to our sacks nice. if you vac them. Just get it out of the fucking frame. Oh. And it just reminded me of the Thomas Sackville stuff that we just had to film yeah. from fucking Haunter. That's going to be And exciting. what a fucking nightmare that was to voice match for me. I had the six pages of dialogue that I had to, uh, to do uh, voice matching for. That's nuts. Yeah, but you're a pro, so... I am a fucking pro, dude. Zip, was, zip, I, I kicked ass. Zip, oh. zoop, zop. You're done. Dude, we had such a great burp something. That was probably yeah, me. Was, yep. yeah. <laughs> I heard that. So has there been an off topic? There's been an off topic since Avengers, right? Last Friday's? Uh, yeah. Y'all yeah. played it on, yeah. did it on yeah. Thursday. We did it on well, Thursday. I think, I think the official spoiler uh, lift is Monday. Monday. That's what that's what the Russo Monday. brothers have said. I mean, we can Monday, dance yeah. around it. Yeah, we've, we've, all, we've all seen it. We won't say, slam Dancing it, like, around Avengers, if you haven't seen it, broadcast, you've all seen it, right? You all, you're all nerds. Also, I will say, I, I saw it Sorry, Simrel, you're posting. He's not off. here, he doesn't count. Yeah, I, I, I saw fucked off. I saw him watch it again. I also, saw Avengers for the third time <laughs> last night, cried for the third time. I didn't yeah. cry the first time. Also, yeah. Game of Thrones is over. It ended Sunday night. <laughs> <laughs> we got three episodes of the Not the left for anybody to give a shit about. They well, killed... there, there's a wrap up. Yeah. Spoiler. Spoiler. There's still music. That would kill, but I don't know. Oh, look bro. who fucking showed up. Look there he is. Side of the dog. Sneaking in the class. Where were like, you when I couldn't remember my name? Diego Slim over it's there. It's hard to sneak in when you're wearing a tie dye shirt, you fuckwit. I had. What? <laughs> <laughs> I had a meeting. Fuck your meetings. Meeting. It's a producer. God damn it. Take your name out of the credits if you have a meeting. Did you talk about RTX? No, not yet. No. Jesus. Well, Alfredo mentioned an old RTX. Does that count? We're gonna talk. Hold on, audience. We're, we're gonna big, talk about RTX. We'll big, talk about HLS. Uh, we'll big, big news. Big news. We're doing RTX life. this year hey. in Austin. You probably already have tickets. Right. There it is. Whoa. There you go. Producing baby. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is why no one likes baby. Me. Uh, okay, I didn't get my okay. tickets yet. We're doing theater mode live. The There's still up. some tickets available. It's at the Paramount this year, which is an awesome theater. Um, we're working on getting a very, very special guest. We're the know first Let's Play Live was. Uh, uh, no, no, well, we're talking about theater mode live right now. So. God damn it! Theater <laughs> mode! Stay on brand, you drunk! Theater mode live is at the Paramount, which actually, no, the first theater mode live was at the Draft House. Uh, anyway, on the Draft House. Um, we've done you're theater mode live. It. Doing theater mode live. We did the tickets, first turn on. Tickets, at the still, so, tickets still available. Uh, not many, though, so please grab tickets. We're doing AH live at the Moody Theater. At ACL in here in Austin, and which it, which is the same place we did the first Let's Play live. Great fact. Where Jeremy pushed me around. That's the journey. that is uh, uh, July fourth. I've yeah, seen that. July fourth, Thursday yeah. before RTX tickets. <laughs> there's a few tickets left for that, and we're we're actually uh, I got an email about a possible sponsor.
concert today. That's super cool. You gotta that, stop talking um, about yeah. it. If it works out, it's we're gonna not be good. gonna yeah. get it. Though. Yeah, you're gonna want to be there. You don't yeah. want to be there. You're gonna be there you when we don't get it. Cries and Brace, you can fly over. We flew to you. Fly to Austin. All right. Here's this. If it just in case, because maybe we'll help push along. SpaceX was gonna bring Falcon Heavy to RTX for Jack, and we were gonna do it on the moon. Yeah, and we were gonna send Jack up to the moon, and he was gonna be as gay as he wanted to all day long. Yeah, so it's not gay. It's a it's reference. It's a reference. It's an old video. It's on the moon. I am wearing. I'm wearing, shirt, I'm wearing my pride shirt. The shirt. The shirt sold out. Jack sold is wearing out. an immunity shirt. You <laughs> 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 can't say anything. That works. That's how it works. No, no, that's, that's how it works. works. That's that's this shirt works. entitles you to one gay joke. That's why all the straight white people got the shirt, and they were like, "I'm good. I'm good." That's why it's sold out. So anyway, uh, July Fourth, Age Live, and then is, is it Friday night or Saturday night? At theater Somebody Mode Live. Friday night. Friday night, Theater Mode Live, July Fifth. All about the shirt. Track. RTX yeah, events. Com. Buy your yeah. tickets right now for those. <laughs> Uh, we also have Jeff's got his his uh, his comedy uh, comedy stand up stuff and kind of kind of comedy yeah with uh, it'll be me Nick uh, Fredo little Alfredo oh. and I don't Dude, know you're who gonna else bomb. is gonna be there. You suck me, <laughs> dude. You know who's gonna bomb? This guy. I got nothing. You gotta get to see his last year's. I can't uh, because Emily pointed out to me. She was like, "What are you gonna do for stand up?" And I was like, "I'll just do my routine." And she goes, "The same routine you did at the same event last year. You think that's smart?" And I went. Ugh. I have I have an outline. I have two different outlines of two different stand-ups. Yeah. I just have to know. It's make like them. the safest, best environment you could ever do. Hard to fail. Stand-up. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I think the the, the stand-up stuff is sold out though, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I don't even have tickets to that. Sold out. Rest Damn in me. peace, Peter Mayhew. Oh yeah, Peter Mayhew. I don't have tickets to any of these events, Shut, Michael. You you're an idiot. Shut I'll up. get you. Shut up. I'll, you'd be my plus one. Jeff will get you. You got idiot. This is st- stupid. Anyway, it's dumb. RTXVid.com. Yeah, right. Buy Stop tickets. saying shit Buy tickets. like that. It's, it's going to be Peter awesome. Mayhew. Also, we got some cool stuff on the show floor this year. I get the, a lot of Cheap Hunter stuff happening. Working on some Voodoo Ranger stuff. Voodoo Ranger. RTX Voodoo Voodoo Ranger. Ranger. Oh, Ranger. Baby. I should talk about that, by the way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go for it. Voodoo Ranger, as you know, ongoing sponsor of Achievement Hunter this year. They're going to be at RTX. If you come by the uh, like Achievement Hunter lounge area or what have you, where they've got the off topic. Uh, Set set up free Voodoo Ranger twenty one and over. So Does it include that one? I mean, I, don't, I assume it includes multiple flavors. Uh, you can check them out on Instagram at Voodoo Ranger. See their awesome selection of beers like IPA, mm-hmm. Imperial IPA, that's which that I one. think that's this one. This is it's a kicker too. Nine percent, nine percent on Imperial that guy, IPA, yeah. Juicy Haze IPA, and Liquid Paradise IPA. The AH Bar at RTX. Uh, they're going to be sponsoring it. Uh, they've got the off-topic set to take pictures. Free Voodoo Ranger. And uh, keep an eye out on the Achievement Hunter social media for a chance to win four Weekend Plus badges to RTX. And that's, that's pretty much it. it. Uh, Liquid Three, Paradise, two, that's the name of that one? That's right? the one that's in the No, tab. no, no, that Juicy Haze is in there. Oh, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Liquid Juicy, Paradise Juicy we have in the cans. Liquid Paradise, Paradise is here. That one's really good. Dude, Liquid I like them all. Great. Oh, I like them all. Like, really good. The Imperial IPA, which I call Greeny, because you yeah. got a green label. This... That stuff will be careful with this that'll shit. That'll get you. A, a beer is usually like four percent. Well, like six. Four, yeah. four, four to six, depending. Mm-hmm. Like depends like, on what state you fi- live in. Fireman's yeah. is four, I think. It depends on the state you live in. Um, um, this is fucking nine. This is like yeah. two and a half. For I'm some admittedly of them. not huge on IPAs, and these are all really good. I'm but glad you admitted it. Are we Thank still you. planning on streaming Borderlands Two? I believe yes. so. Yes, we, we have. We some were time. just talking about it the other day. We tried to film it this week. We tried to do this do week, and we just didn't have time. And we won't have time uh, next week because I won't be here. So you better not fucking stream. The streaming, the streaming stuff's been fun, man. I like that we can do stuff on our streams now because we're streaming five days a week. Yeah. So we're streaming. We can do stuff that we don't normally do. Like I've been playing Kingdom the Game, which is one of my favorite little indie games with Fiona. It's a lot of fun, man. Yeah, I've been streaming like just Apex with Fiona yeah. in the mornings. It's, it is a blast. Yeah, it's, really, it's nice. Like, chill. It's nice pressure. just to sit down and. Start your day, and it's almost like yeah, you know, reading the paper with your morning coffee, yeah. just having have a couple rounds, talk to Fiona, super chill. learn more about how yeah. weird and fascinating she is. You know? Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday, we go from ten a.m. to twelve, and then nope, sorry, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, ten a.m. to twelve. Mondays is our sponsored stream at three, that and then Fridays at twelve. It was that a little was embarrassing, a but what saved it is I saw Stevie type stay in your LAN in the chat. So that's yeah, also that was embarrassing. More embarrassing. Oh, there was a double bot shot. There was a double bot. Are we, we going to do anything with those streams? Like, are we archiving them anywhere? Or if, if someone so, wants to yeah, watch so, the stream, what happens? So Mondays are our sponsor streams. Those are always go up the following Tuesday. Okay. And then the idea is that Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday are kind of just like chill streams. It could be anything from just, you know, Jeff and Fiona. Chatting, playing Apex and podcasting to you doing, you know, Kingdom, whatnot. Maybe Jeremy's doing Borderlands. 
And then Friday, we're going to try and make them tentpole streams where it's like, okay, we're going to do Gmod and, okay. and all that kind of stuff. And like we'll today we did Deceit. And, yeah, which today we like did Deceit. like a big game for Gmod. And, and then that'll, that'll go up on, on the YouTube channel. So, the, so the, those midweek ones, they're just kind of like out there? Just, 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 okay. just chill. But I mean, I mean say, I've say, seen people have been asking, are we going to be archiving yeah, those? No, it's, it's open to interpretation too because like if, if like Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, if you're just like, hey, this was really good and we really liked it and it was a good time and it, it, you know, it's worth leaving up, then cool, leave it up. Okay. Hey, can I can I do a poll? Poll. Can we do poll. a poll with, with more than two options? Get that megaphone Go out the there. Megaphone. Can we do a Jimmy three Hunter option top. poll? Poll now. I'm gonna let the audience pick. I, I, instead of playing Apex all the time, I've been wanting to revisit some stuff. Audience, would you rather see me do a Gems of War, a series of Gems of War streams? <laughs> Viva Pinata, Trouble in Paradise. Oh, dude, I vote Viva. Or, I vote Viva as well. Or Peggle too. I vote Viva Ooh, I vote Pinata. Pinata. Yeah, like those Pedal. are the three games that Viva I. Viva Pinata is yep. a definition of a chill stream. I can this yeah. guy knows people it. People would watch you stream. He knows Viva. it. I love. Well, I love all three games. of those games. Those are like my th- like. Dude, my, I'll watch those you are farm. My, those are my spirits. I'll watch you farm and play and Fable shit as well, and like watch animals fuck Burp each other. So That's yeah. why. If am yeah. I? Am I? Yeah, really? did you just burp again. I did, but yeah. Terrible. This goddamn mind. Sorry. Is this not? I don't want to overstep here, but can I say that? Vote. Simple Jeff is inspired by Viva Pinata. Oh, you had all your chickens and your farm and everything, and like that was your bread and butter because because of you Viva knew Pinata. Viva Pinata so well. Probably, yeah. I'd love to see that, dude. I fucking love Viva Pinata. Yeah. I'm not logged in. Tick one so, vote for so me. Gems of War, Viva Pinata, or Peggle. You fucking better do it. Just right. let me know. Well, no, you, you well, go, to, go to the uh, nose yell it. We can't. The chat. You yeah, don't, don't do type chat. it in the chat. Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. That's it can nothing. be any Peggle, any Viva Pinata. What you're doing there is wasting. What you're doing is just like wasting movement. You're just like walking out to the street and just yelling stuff. Yeah. How do I log in? It doesn't in? go anywhere. I, I log in through Facebook. Bankruptcy! <laughs> you can't just say it. I, I, vote, I voted it. for Peggle too, Jeff. <laughs> I didn't vote for shit. What did you say? I voted for Peggle too. Okay. 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 Dot com slash I Wait, is that what it was? Oh, that's cool. I mean, I'm happy to yeah, just keep playing Apex, but I thought it'd be fun to play something that I am that I know like Jeremy knows Spyro. Not that I know any of those games, anything on earth as well as Jeremy knows Spyro. I don't know my dick as well as Jeremy knows Spyro, but... You know, I don't know my dick as well. Team Aspire. No, Nova Ramsey is that your is that your Fiona team name? Nova That's Ramsey. a shitty. Dude, name. Somebody popped yeah. a great team name for Alfredo and I earlier. <laughs> <laughs> we were we were laughing about it. Y'all, y'all were talking, so we didn't bring it up. But it, it was Team Fat Boy Slim. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> that's was that the good. three of us? That's just he and I. Oh, okay, fine. Because <laughs> fuck yeah. you, Jack. Because he's fat. Boy you can be in it. I thought it was Fat Boy Slim. Okay, there you go. That's See, what that's that's what I thought. I'm just trying to shoehorn myself into more teams. No, we know. I, I'm we here. Know. What's Angry Fat? It was the one I screamed when we were trying to do a team. Hi, Daniel. Yeah. It's Daniel Fabello, everybody. Hey, it's D-Fat. Hey, you know Daniel hates yes. movies? So I took, we went and saw Endgame last night. Oh he my liked God. Endgame. Yeah, that's what you were saying. I was saying. very happy about it. Oh, talking? okay. Daniel's he liked, never, I've never seen Daniel like anything. I think he was just trying to end the conversation. He liked, he liked Infinity War. Oh, he liked Infinity the War. The only movie he likes, he likes is, Civil Lucky, War. is Logan Lucky. Logan Lucky. I say this too. <laughs> you don't like it? No, he doesn't like that either. I'll tell I know. You I will so. say he he loves Almost Famous. He, like he would marry Almost Famous if it was a, if it was a human. Haunter. That's true. He hates it. Oh. Um, I, I watched like a couple episodes that he sent us. He was like, "Here's some cuts of the episode." The whole side of it is just him saying everything. What's well, weird that he included it. voiceover him, him saying, "This scene sucks." Yeah, <laughs> yeah. this is stupid. It's weird. Dude, I love that. that. There's every now and again, you know, there's shots where it's like you a wide shot, true. and it's like, you know, they'll have. Jeff saying something like, all right, we're heading to this place, and just kind of like background stuff for the show and graphics. Uh, but they have someone else do like a VO line, and it's like Jeff oh, Wolf, the Jeff narration. Will be over here. Yeah. My God, that narration so is the blandest. <laughs> That's like, the way for everything. It's though. so funny. He's like, we will be heading over to this place yeah. and then studying the ghosts in the area. That's, it looks that's like, it's, it's, it's like, like I feel like that's necessary. I want that's them part to actually the leave that. They did that shit for Laser Team too. It is. They do like pickups, and it's like. Damn, Hagen, what's going on here? I can't believe this shit. It's it is kind of like <laughs> this is gonna be our most dangerous haunt yet. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll all make it out alive. <laughs> Jeff looks. They want you to play Viva Pinata. As yeah. Well. Oh, he's he's farming Viva and he's pinata. making pinata characters fuck. You I wish I didn't already have a thousand That's points things. in it because I would just re-point it. Mm. Oh, let well, me ask the no, audience. No, no. There's probably Ow. like there's probably like a remastered or something, right? I don't think, there's, there's, I don't I think, think there is. Fuck you, that doesn't help. Let me ask you guys another question. That's the right. same list. What's that, Jeff? The, the, the fucking, another poll! The poll will answer the Viva Pinata shit. But um uh <clears throat> I fucking forgot what I was gonna ask. Well, oh right. my god. Oh my god! Ask. I don't know. We were t- we were shitting on Daniel for a second. We were shitting on Daniel. No, no, no wait. And then we were talking it. about Vignon and this fatty. Pulls. He's fat. We talked about that. Yeah, you mm-hmm. weren't even asking for it there. What? 
the fatness. Yeah. I mean, that, I'm that, that just oh, came no, out. No, I this remember, is asking for it. I remember. It's, it's, this is gonna be, it's, is, you know, I'm having fun with it. It'll be funny when I just work out and get buffed for the fuck of it. I got it. I, I got it. Okay. So get I was. Buffed for the fuck of it. That's a new show. We, we, were, <laughs> we read the calories. We off. were dicking around. <laughs> no, we don't know. We were dicking around in Minecraft Xbox the other day when we resurrected oh, yeah. that old ass save of Achievement City, That's right. uh, which already, uh, as far as you know, broken is gone and you'll never see again. Uh, it burned. The Xbox mm -hmm. burned to the ground. Um, Except it like burned. It was like acid, like alien acid. It like burned through my desk into the ground, and it's now somewhere <laughs> under the earth. Uh, but I, I loaded up the other version of Minecraft on the Xbox, which is the Windows Windows 10 version compatible version yeah. that supposedly has parody. I just wanted to see if it did. Good lord, and I'll talk does. about the musical in a minute. Calm down, everyone. But that new version of Minecraft has 102 achievements in it, nice. and I have none of them. Which means I don't think any of you guys have any of them either. I perfected. It's it. a lot of <laughs> the old stuff we've already done. It's the original. It's every right. achievement, but there's a hundred and two of them. Don't say we've all done including it. Yeah. up to like like sound the alarm when a pillager when a, when pillagers Ravagers. show up. Like you hit the bear, apparently the bell. the bell is to is to warn the villagers to hide from the pillagers. So it, it's all the way up. Oh, to so the pillagers when you guys were we'll playing see. with it in, a, in an upcoming Minecraft, you were just Probably. scaring all the villagers. To <laughs> yeah, like, what the and fuck? we were like, I don't want to spoil an upcoming Minecraft, but we tried to fuck around with the pillagers. Stuff and we were exploring all the yeah, new we, shit in the we game. Do it like but there are achievements update. on the Xbox that are tied to all that, or I guess on the PC if you want to do it on PC. But would there be any interest in the? Because I thought it'd be a fun thing, like, even if it's a side supplemental series. We don't do it on Fridays, whatever. Even if we only do it on stream, is there any interest from the audience in seeing us try to go from one achievement to one hundred and two? As a series, and just try to get all 102 I'll achievements honest, in the new Minecraft. I have interest in that. I would love you to do, do that. or do not. Do I, I this, also you have watch interest. it on the treadmill? I would love to do that. I also have interest, and we've had let's plays that have done very well. On a rail did very well, right? We did that twice. We did zombie village, like Hilo zombie villager. That did very well as a let's play. We did uh, a we whole did let's the play where we stuff. got the wither and the beacon. The beacons and the withers. Yeah. So we we've done some of it before. So a little bit would be retreaded territory, but not Mochimans, for Alfredo. That's what or, it's called. Yeah, Dude, achievements. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. I'm a but Minecraft I just love that it's now. like it's like You're that number. Well, yeah. something about that number one hundred two. <laughs> you seen the first couple just episodes? feels. Meaty to me, like it would be a thing <laughs> to acquire a hundred and two achievements in Minecraft. It's, that's like MCC it's territory. That's like Master Chief Collection. Especially, well, there's a there. lot of them too that are. People said yes a lot. Yeah, there's a lot. Of, there's yeah. a lot. Saw two nose. There's a lot of them that are yes tough. Do they, no do, boss, can you they can really you get are. dedicated servers with can that you? version? Because it'd be, it'd be interesting if we could do it and like work on stuff outside of recording. Because a lot of it's like make a beacon. It's like fuck. That's gonna be I seven episodes of just mining iron. I don't know, but we can look into it. Because I would do also, stuff like that as offline. Also, the store is pretty cool. It's got tons of mashup packs and skins and like yeah. worlds you can download and buy. Um, we just when we switched over to PC, we never fucked with it again. But there's some interesting stuff there. Yeah, if, you, yeah. if you need a knight Ooh, in Minecraft sink. to protect the land, I talked about it with, with I Trevor a little up. bit. I don't have the idea fully baked yet, but y'all think about it and see if you can come up with a way that we'll it makes sense for us to it, do and it. We'll find. Yeah, we'll, yeah. We'll, we'll, Let's yeah. go to California, get super baked. Well, or we, Canada, <clears throat> not Texas though, because they have a million all that. things to do in or Minecraft. Canada. Yeah, Texas is about to make uh, marijuana laws a lot. Easier in Texas, and they and uh, our lieutenant governor killed it. I yeah. guess yeah. you're fucked. It was two thirds. Yeah. It was two, thir yeah. two thirds of Texans and like sixty percent of Republicans were saying that'd be cool, and the lieutenant governor was like, "Nope, we're not wow. even, not even going to talk about it." And so yeah. he killed Jack it. Mm. can't smoke the gun. Can't political because he loves drugs. To be to be fair, Alabama to, just legalized medical marijuana. How fucking backwards has Texas yeah. got to be? But to be to be fair, the uh, what they were going to instate in, within the entire uh, state of Texas is actually not even as lenient as it is in Dallas, Houston, Austin, and San Antonio already. Yeah. So it still would have been like I mean, right now if you get busted in, in Austin with like. Less than I think it's an ounce of weed. You get like a, a ticket. You don't get arrested. It's up to the discretion of the officer. Yeah, I think. yeah. They and so, let you go or... but this would basically make it where like anywhere in the state, it was a little, fuck, little like less good. important. Yeah. But just make sure so, you're in Travis County, anyway. not Williamson County. Williamson County, you'll go to jail for the rest of your life. Yeah, or you know, spend a night in jail, even though you you know weren't driving illegally. Um, Damn, anyway, dude. If you're curious yeah. about the musical, the musical, I'm writing the rest of the songs this month. At the beginning of June, I'm going and hanging out with JT Music and putting music to all of the songs. End of June, getting all of these guys to sing the songs, and then sometime July, put it all together and la, la, have it out la, la. by August-ish. So, it's coming. It's moving yeah. along. Do you, do you have so. to sing, or can a, can a brother rap? I mean, no, you'll sing. You'll do. Yeah. This brother gonna rap. I, I was working on, no, I was working on something rap. that oh, may, may be Sorry, falling through. So. This brother is going to rap. 
That's so why I, I need to say that. I'm working on something that, that may be falling through. If that falls through, I might have to lean on Jeremy to possibly help me with the rap, but there it we'll is. see. <laughs> Again, if you don't want to, you don't have to. I'm not forcing you to do it. Like everyone assume like, Raps Jack's like handing it off to fucking Jeremy. I was like, no, never. Never. It was always my thing. If he doesn't want to do it, he doesn't have to do it. My thing. Rap so if you don't want to do it, they know why. But if he wants to write a rap, you. we can do that because I have an idea that we can you do. You can shut down. Huh? Hard. Somebody said you're getting shut down hard in this podcast. Can you can you write a Who rap? Who is Alfredo? Alfredo? Yeah. How so? What do you mean? Alfredo, the floor is yours. Trying to talk? Oh, the floor is mine. He gets too much floor. I get a lot of floor. <laughs> he gets so much. I like do like a lot of like snowflakes. <laughs> My name is Alfredo, and I'm here to rap. I'm gonna. Nope. Oh, You've lost wow. it already. <laughs> Well, yeah, was an attack. For a second, I was like, this guy could do Play Pals, and Dude, no. That would have been it. Although, you could do Gavin and just go, I can't, <laughs> I can't even do the, the, wait, the, the Play Pals thing. The, the way you just spit out words, yeah, and Yeah, but most of the time, it doesn't work. Someone said I, had a good time the, I had a good one in the office the other day. Someone said the live-action Red Dead 2 rap was pretty awesome. Is that out? That's up. Is it out? Well, I should check the JT Music. The what? Uh, I may I may have helped out the JT Music guys something. Did you or did you not? What do you mean you may have? I did, I don't know if they put it out Jesus Christ. Well. JT Music. What a big win for them. They got an actual character from Red Dead 2 to be in their uh, in their video. I mean, they already had a Red Dead 2. They've got a music, music video, like, like a song about yes. Red Dead 2. Mm -hmm. uh, I forget. I forget the name. Ride or Die might have been called, but it it's awesome. Like it's insanely good. Those guys are fucking talented. Yeah, they are. Uh, albums. Those are really nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I got yeah. to work with them with a awesome. Spiral rap, and it was a lot of fun. They're, 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 get the, you like Spiral? That's horrible. I've dabbled. Those genuinely lovely dudes. There it is. Let me see. If I uh, did, uh, and I saw the chat asking about it. I did uh, two rage quits the other day. Yeah. Because I just decided I don't value my own life. Um, <laughs> Good. I just hadn't done it in a while, and I just got a hankering. We were sitting around not filming, and I was like, I'm just going to go film rage quit. And then I did, I finished one, came back. Still, we weren't doing anything, so oh, I'm, I'm going to do another one. Did you come back during a, oh, Trevor and I were filming. The second one, yeah, right you guys set. were doing the, the, hero we the, need. the show. The second one was an hour long. Oof. And I just like, I tweeted about it and I was like, I filmed two conclusion, I'm too old for this shit. And a lot of people were like, oh, you just can't get mad anymore. I'm like, no, that's not the problem. It's just like my brain was breaking. You were I was just like, when I was, you came I was like on the floor for like an hour and a half and I was just like this, like, oh, you guys filmed another video and I was just like, I can sit this one out. I just like, I'm gonna die. Michael came I back in, you guys were filming Trivi. Mm. And it was oh, I was it sitting was. in my chair and Michael just walked in and he was just on the floor at his desk like this. Dude, I had a headache for like six hours after that. Um, but in the middle of that, talking about like rapping, I kept just reverting into Play Pals. Because I, 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 people were asking I, I, what I, games I, I played. One of the games that. I did was um, Geometry Dash, okay. which I think is coming out next week. I'm gonna do I'm gonna put that one out first. Um, and it's like super like it's got a great beat. It's got awesome music. It's, it's, one of those, it's like yeah. it's it's. I, and I figured that one should go out first. I filmed it second, so of course, me my dialogue in it probably makes no sense because the first video I'm like I haven't made one in a couple of years, whatever. And then I did the second one, but it's such a classic because it's basically the impossible game, like plus, like there's more shit to it. Like you turn and you turn into other shit besides a square, and it's just like. It's just like someone took Impossible Game and went, I'll just make, I'll add more shit to it. Mm -hmm. So I thought that was like an appropriate one to put out first after like two years since the last Rage Quit came out. But like, God damn, it was catchy and I just kept singing while I was playing it. Hey, uh, clear something up real fast. Uh -oh. You uh -oh. said you recorded for an hour on the second video, uh -huh. or over an hour. Yeah. That doesn't mean you're gonna have an edited hour long rage quit because people are now very excited to think there's an hour long. No, rage quit. no, no, no. 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 Make sure well, that, that will be that, that will be twenty That's minutes. Limited. The thing about the thing about that one in particular. So I did two videos. Um, the first one was like twenty five minutes, but like, it's very quick, right? Like, Geometry Dash, much like Impossible Game, is without checkpoints. You can play the whole goddamn level and not die once. So there's gonna be a lot of like, you know, I, I mean, I without keeping track of time, like some levels might be like, do it perfect for three minutes, you know, or like two minutes. So a lot of that is like just playing back up to where the fuck I got. So it's yeah, all gonna get cut out. people remember that like- If it's like, if it's like, I get, I die, cut, I die, cut, I die. It could be 10 seconds, could be four minutes yeah, of me like playing. Like Rage Quit, even like Impossible Game and stuff like that. There were times where you would, Try to jump over something, you would yell, and then it cuts, and the attempts go from like a hundred to two hundred and thirteen. Right, and it, like you yell again. So there's like, there's those big gaps. There's that's there's what makes a, it work. there's a fair amount of gap in this one, just because like I would get so close to the end of the level and then die, and then it's like two minutes to get back to where I was. So it's like, Rage Quit to me was always like it was an escalation. I yeah. want to show the beginning 
800 times, except the, like, then I get trial syndrome where I almost beat the level and then I die 15 times in the uh. first two seconds. Like that I'm sure will be in there, but I don't know, it's fun. And also if you actually watch it and it gets views, I might make more. But it really, I really died a little bit. You mentioned I the, felt my life leaving me. You mentioned as I was trial syndrome, and tired. that reminds me of like Cloudberry. I, I, I mentioned this week. There's an idea I have that I'm curious how the audience react to it. Fortnite has death runs, which are essentially Cloudberry levels. There's like 3D Cloudberry levels. I'm thinking of trying to maybe do a few of those. Do you think that's a good idea? Let me know. It's. I mean, it's when you say Fortnite, people assume like, oh, a battle royale. No, no, this is like literally. Just it, all it is is just platforming through something over and you just die over and over and over and over. Right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And so I'm curious if you guys would dig that. I think I'm gonna probably give it a shot no matter what, at least once. But I, I think it'd be fun. I know like uh, like Laser Beam does a lot of those, and so Laser Beam, Laser Beam, dude, it looked interesting. It looked Di nothing, Diamond yeah. Beam, it looked nothing. But I mean, aside from like the skin of Fortnite, Hashtag you were like going down them. Fucking volcano yeah, and yeah. shit. Like, I, I just, like, I just ice skates. Cool. I was like, this I popped is open different. one. I'm like, oh, okay. This I can see my because I'm I'm a I'm a stubborn gamer that I will beat my head against the wall for hours until I get past something. That's why I love trials. That's why I love Cloudberry. I did with Bloodborne. And it's very very much my style of uh, my my style <laughs> of game. I think so. No, yeah. I'm seeing I'm seeing no, a yes, even split no, here. So, so, no, so, no, so, yes, so what Jack no, is saying yes, is he's yes, bringing yes, back forced and make a ball. Yeah, make a ball. So do you want to see do you want to see Jack play Fortnite? Yes or no? There we go. Make a ball. Right. I also thought well, about that say, say that say like cool Fortnite stuff. I also yeah. thought about that as you were saying it, which now is like stepping on toes. So I'll let you do that, and I was oh, just right. like, oh, that'd probably be a good rage quit, like Fortnite. I mean, we oh. could try that. I mean, uh, okay, I mean, the level looked hard. It Where do I see that polls? I don't. On the top of the dot com slash. Play? Play, yeah. Play? Play. com slash play? I think so. I think. Oh, another poll? Dang. I need yeah. to see What's the... Up? Michael, on the topic of Rage What's Quit, up? one of my favorite parts about you recording Rage Quit the other day is like, so I came back in the office, uh, we recorded one episode of Ready, Set, Show, we were getting ready to do another one. Come back in the office and Fiona is in the main office and you're sitting in this like side room recording Rage Quit and there's a window there right. that you next can to see Jack's between desk. the two... Right next to Jack's desk, you can see between <clears> the two rooms. And Fiona is just standing in the window like this, watching Michael do Rage Quit. And then, and then like, we'll hear Michael go like, God damn it! And people go, oh, he was so close. <laughs> oh, he was right there. She was just like up against the glass watching him. She that was, was like, pretty funny. She was like, yeah. I watched Rage Quit. That's what that's the achievement that, of content I watched. That's also watched really Rage funny Quit. to me because like, I didn't know that. Lindsay told me that. And also yeah. like, I finished recording and I looked and she was still at the window and I was like, <laughs> yeah, and she then, was fucking she was, out. So then, she like, was but, but, but really yeah. funny. So then, like, I joked, and I put there's a sword right on that window, like yeah. on a stand, and I pointed at it jokingly that I was like, "Kill Jack, kill him," because he was at his. <laughs> I'm desk. right next to the window. Yeah. She picked up the sword and then hit him with the butt of the sword. <laughs> yeah. and I was like, I was like "What the I'm fuck was kidding. that?" <laughs> and then well, she like, picked up. I have an apple of Eden that someone sent me. She picked it up and threw it dude, at me. I, I love how like mean she is. I love it. Yeah. Um. But like Lindsay told me that afterwards, she was like, "Yeah, Fiona was like saying like you know she didn't really watch a lot." Of Rooster Teeth stuff, but like she watched Rage Quit, and I was thinking about it, and like I don't know when she watched it, but I was just like, because I, I say a lot in the video, the narrative is just like, man, I'm fucking old, and I was just like, Fiona was 14 when Rage Quit came out. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. damn. And then I turned to dust. And <laughs> yeah. I like, someone, someone, went, and yeah. I just went off into the wind. What was the god damn? How do I see that other poll? The the first one? Yeah. It was, it, was, it, was, it was Viva Pinata. It was Viva Pinata. Okay. It, it, was, it was like 63 or 64 percent Viva. It was hard. Pinata. Um, so right, but it was actually kind of fun doing it. We got 70 30 for the death run stuff. So right. I mean, I'll, I'll, it. Go we'll, for it. We'll, I think I'll make at least shit. one. I'll make one and see how it goes. I mean, because it's, it's it's Fortnite, but it's not it's not what people think when you when you say Fortnite, you're expecting like fucking, you know, I don't know, Marshmallow doing a concert or something like that. But this is more of a. That was actually pretty cool. Yeah, this is more of a. It's a yeah, death run, which is a game mode. So, we'll see. If you are a fan of Fortnite, check out the Rooster Teeth store and buy some of Lannan's merch. That's true. Well, Absolutely. Little, little shitbag Diamond Lannan. Hashtag Dude. yeet. Hashtag code got a, He got a yeet tattoo in Comic Sans on and, his arm. And, and code laser. And code laser. Did he really? Yeah, yeah in what? Comic Sans on yeah. his fucking arm. Jack, uh, Jack tweeted several times, I'm going to fly to Australia I don't want to be a content creator anymore. Yeah. I, said, I said I'm going to fly to Australia and slap you. Uh, also, I, I saw a photo of him. Yeet, yeah. what he said I saw a photo of him. It was like his profile. Picture or something? Is it's it not? Bald? Is it Photoshop? It's Photoshop with him bald. Right? There's, yeah. there's he's not actually tattoo, bald, there's, but yeah, that is real. Good. You Jeremy. fucking stay away from that. That's, I don't give a shit. As long as he's real. not bald, you. That's Jeremy. Yeah. To be fair, though, like he's got ten million subs. Nobody knows who you are anyway. I'm just saying. 
If he goes bald, you're copying. Oh, him. are you dude, doing the that's Lannan? What I'm, gonna yeah. do. I'm just saying, dude. I'm he, going to. He went like this. He he the, like a sucker. He gave all this money to Laser Team and was like, "Oh, I'm just I'm coming to America." He's like, he's like "Oh, oh, can I have an autograph? Can I suck your dick?" Here we go. I'll visit the RT building, and he was like, "I can do this," and then he did it way better. Yeah, he did. And that's it. That, what a look at his stupid mouth too in that photo. He's like, "Uh, I got it." Great guy. Awesome guy. The other thing about Landon too, he's 16. It's yeah. true. 10 million subs. He's 16? Well, no, not really. He's like 25. <laughs> okay. Well, Is he that, that old? I thought he was like 23 or 24. Well, like, there's he no was. way. Do you not recall when he was chugging beer on stage with us? Yeah, but Australia's <laughs> different. You can drink Australia's beer four there. Dude, yeah, we're in another one. land. Chugging beer, you recall him, he was like, oh, I can't drink a whole beer in one sitting on stage. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck it was. Oh, yeah, he had his one beer started crying. He's like, oh, I'm dying. <laughs> Dude, what, what if I... <laughs> Or by Gainway. I don't know what accent that's Oh, right, man, yeah. I'm Australian now. <laughs> or am I? Or am I? What's in your cell? I saw, your saw you going to, that's what I he saw was you doing. to sheriff mode when you were All like, right, then, oh, my name is Laser Beam. Welcome to Australia. Oh, yeah. insulting man. <laughs> <laughs> that's the new thing. Uh, well, not new, but Tr Trevor and I quote that a lot to Michael. You know, we do the things that we hear someone else say something in a video, and then we just say it all the fucking time. Like the Sheriff of Nottingham thing is what we do to Mike. I don't know if I mentioned it in the pod. I might have, but Trevor texted me like two weeks ago. It was like on a Saturday morning. It was like eight o'clock in the morning. And he just texted me, I remember what you said to me. Or something like that. Like, I remember what you said. And I was like, the fuck does that mean? Yeah. And I replied back to him and I'm like, I've said a lot. <laughs> I don't know what the I was, I was like, is he is he mad? Is he right? I don't know what he's talking about. And he was like, I don't know, it was I remember what you said to me. I'm like, oh yeah, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Right over my head. I don't. I didn't know he was quoting me. I was just like, "Oh shit, what is Trevor?" I want? bought that game. A Boss little while man, ago. Trevor. He's probably bitching about me about something. Like he would have been here, but Alfredo took his spot. Yeah, I, I bought that game recently, he's Sheriff he's of Nottingham. And when I bought it, I yeah. took a picture well, of it and texted it to, it to Trevor and said, "Remember what I said to you?" <laughs> Any, uh, anybody <gasps> watch uh, season two of Barry yet? I haven't no, watched I didn't one know yet. Was I watched the first episode. I saw a clip of it, and I'm like, fuck, I need to start watching it was this good. again. I watched the first episode. It was really good. It was cool. I was wondering how they were going to season, season continue one the fun. story. It was so good. And it's pretty Man, cool. Betty. Also, the new Anthony Jezelnik stand-up on Netflix is phenomenal. That's a made-up name, you just said. Jezelnik? Jezelnik, yeah. Jezelnik. Jezelnik? Jezelnik. Isn't that his name? Jezelnik. That was my nickname in high school. Hang on, what is it? What is it? Jessel Nick. Yeah, Jessel Nick. Nick. Shut Jessel. up, Eric! Not him. Eric's still here. That's anyway, his awesome. new his new story. Oh, you don't have a meeting. Great. He's got a meeting to go to. Oh, he's so important. Oh, oh, look at me. My name is Eric Meeting. Oh. I'm going around and tell Jeremy who Ryback is. <laughs> is that true? He talked about wrestling before and you weren't here. You weren't here to back me up. Yeah, who the fuck is Ron Smackdown? Was that his name? <laughs> Ron Smackdown? He invented yeah, it. Yeah, Ron Smackdown. Anyway, Barry's good. Bill Hader Eric. is awesome. Yeah. That show was I bought amazing. a shirt with your face on it. Oh, yeah. I saw that. Wait, what? You, so Mega, Mega, 60, Mega oh, 64 okay. had, a, had a 64 hour sale and it's a picture of Eric and it says, Gone Too Soon. <laughs> yeah. I immediately bought it. I saw it and was like, oh, let we me should buy a fucking, fucking credit card. It's already too late. Yeah. It's, the sale's over. That's too bad. We I happen to see it. Dude, I never, like, again, I, buy I, I, don't, price. I don't have any push notifications on social media. So all the time people are like, you see that? I'm like, nope. Mm -hmm. Lindsay, number one. She's like, oh, did you see my post? I'm like, no. Did you tell me about it? Like, fuck that. I don't want any yeah. alerts on my phone. Mm -hmm. There it is. Shit. That's it. That's the shirt I bought. We should get one for every Why is your hair like that? But because he was wearing what a wig. What does that mean? That's how my hair looks. Shut up. No, it isn't. Why is it? No. You wish you looked why like that. Why is your face that way? Yeah. That's Where'd how you get I that gun? <laughs> <laughs> he, Thank you, he Cody. He looks like Todd Howard from Bethesda. <laughs> That's awesome. God, why are you so <laughs> like pixelated, Eric? You're so I, pixelated. I'm stupid. That. I fucking saw that immediately snatched it up. But I will. I can ping. I can ping Sean or Here's the thing. We, I, we can get those. Well, I mean, we can get more of them. I mean, I oh, will. Yeah. God. I will be reimbursed because obviously I'm not spending my own money on that. Yeah. You will gonna, play Skyrim. I'm submit it. Oh God. <laughs> Eric, do you, are you pixelated like that yeah. in real life? Yeah, that's yes. how I look. I if you get close to him, you're like it's a, a condition. You look like a shitty doctor. Who? Terrifying. Thanks, the man. Other, the other thing I was laughing at, and somebody mentioned this earlier, um, Sonic, like 
the Sonic trailer came out. Oh, yeah. The fiasco. Greatest and, trailer ever. And now, Dude, why and is now, Gates like, of Paradise in that And now, trailer. it makes no sense. And now, because of cultural appropriation. Now they said that they're changing the look of Sonic. They're going to, like, they change are. his teeth. They're, they're, gonna, they're gonna edit it. Did you see the tweet? Because they said, hashtag, gotta fix fast. Yeah. yeah. Oh, they said that? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, the director <laughs> tweeted that, right? Well, it's like, yeah. Here's the thing. Why did you do that? I mean, why did it get to this like, point? Like, I just yeah. don't understand. The, the, you know what I mean? I'll like, tell you. I'll tell you why they did it. I'll tell you 100 percent because I know how these decisions are made now. After working in this industry for 16 years, they focus grouped it and it went through a focus group and and received positives. Of who? who? The people that don't know from Sonic? the, from the just, random people. It just doesn't make any oh, sense. And and so they got a sign off on Listen, that one. They said, "Here's the thing. Here's the thing about it. Look at them DSLs. <laughs> here's the thing about it. Right? Like." Nah. Can you say whatever or about small that? lips? It's a stupid video game movie, and it's again, of course, like let's take a cartoon and put it in real life. Yeah. But like, I, it's not gonna win an Oscar. But like, I was fine with the trailer. Sonic is the worst part. Yeah. Like, the worst part. Why yeah. did you make him? Jim Carrey looks, looks great. Awesome. I'm, a, at the I'm end. a big fan of James Marsden. He's yep. cute. He's yeah. Cyclops. Get the chat back he was up. in Enchanted. He was great yeah. in Sex great Drive. Enchanted. I'm fans of. I'm a fan. I'm one Thank single you. person. You get the dude from Major League. I'm a fan uh, of all that. What's that guy's name, Jeff? Uh, Charlie Sheen. No, wrong, wrong dude. Not, oh, not Bobby sorry. Uh, 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 <laughs> Fuck you, Joe Boo. Uh, uh, no, not him. Uh, the one who was like who the main character. Who Stop snapping! Oh, You're just Bob wiping Uker. half of the goddamn universe every time. What was the guy's name? We're down to like a thirty I don't even know second who you're talking point about. of the, the, the dude who was the, the military guy that Jim Carrey kept like oh, I don't I don't care shut up oh, oh that, that guy. guy the guy oh. from uh, Ra Tom Tom uh, not Tom Sizemore uh, Tom the, the guy Tom from Sizemore what are you not crazy the guy from Ravenous um. Is it Tom? Not Tom Scarrett. Fuck. What? No, who? his He's name creepy. isn't Tom. Uh, I know you're talking about it. Oh, good lord. I, I don't know. He plays a bad guy a lot. Also, he was, um, uh, he lived near Andy on Cape Cod. He lived like around the block from him. Jim Carrey? Nope. Tom Berenger. Tom Berenger, thank nope. you. Who, that wasn't Tom Berenger. That wasn't Tom Berenger. That wasn't Tom Berenger. That wasn't him. That's who you're talking about was not him. That's crazy what you're saying. All right, yeah. fucking. I'm that's, looking it up. That's dead wrong. Neil Don McDonough? Yes. Yeah, Neil McDonough. Yeah. Whatever. Neil McDonough. The, 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 there we the go. Fucking Neil, dumb, Neil dumb McDonough. Dugan from, from, from Captain America. Yeah. yeah, Neil dumb McDonough. As that Major guy. Bennington Neil, in the Sonic Neil Don movie. Donahue, right? Yeah. How does it pronounce McDonough? it? McDonough. 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 Shut up. McDonough. No. Anyway, McDonough. that guy. Yes. Thank you. Robotnik's name is Evo. Fuck him. Who? Shut up. His what? name's Robotnik. Okay. That's Doctor Evo Robotnik. I don't give a Robotnik. shit. I don't give a fuck about His name Eggman. Is Evo? I fuck about all your crap. Doctor Evo Robotnik. It's Ivo, isn't it? Evo. I, Ivo. Evo. I think Ivo? you would pronounce that Evo. Is it like the, the, the fighting game tournament, or is it? What is it? Is it Ivo? Ivo. It's not Evo. It's not Evo. That's Timothy crazy. Oliphant. <laughs> he is amazing in uh, Santa Clarita Diet. Watch the entire series. Caught up two days later, they cancel it. <laughs> so you How are many seasons that show. Three. The it's Death really Hill. good. That's what it's I was fucking funny. Gonna start it. It's super like, funny. It's like twenty-seven minute episodes. Is it a so zombie they, they show? Fly like, by. Yeah. yeah, it is, yeah. but it's not like any other one. Like, I think I couldn't. It's really speaking funny. of zombie show. iZombie, Zombie uh, final season starting like this weekend. Yeah, yeah. season five. I think five, five or six. I think it's five. It's five. Yeah. So Wrong watch that. Go, go support a boy. Iva. It's absolutely nothing like Iva. Uh, Iva. Iva. You're right. Iva. Iva. Right, there we what go. What kind of name is Iva? What is kind she... of name is Evo? Ace Ventura Robotnik. I don't know. Anyway. Robotnik. I'm fine Eggman. with the movie. It Sonic just looks fucking stupid. Yeah. I don't understand. They made him so tall. Yeah. And like, his face is weird. Like just make him. I look mean, like, like Sonic. Sonic. Has, I don't understand. Sonic. It. He's got the big head, skinny body, big feet. And it's like, here's the thing. Right, there's also Sonic. there's two Sonics. There's the original Sonic, and then they made him taller and thinner. Yeah. Like OG Sonic is like fat Pikachu. And there's like yeah. Dream yeah. Cat Sonic. Shorter and fatter. And like real round. And then they yeah, were like, no, no, no. He's really got to be taller round. and thinner. And there's a huge debate among Sonic fans of that. But I would have been fine with either. This, yeah, this, this either is of those. bizarro yeah. freak monster there's, Sonic. There's and I don't know what the hell they were thinking. That both those Sonics had in common. And it's that big like one eye that Sonic has. Like his eyes. Yeah, he's, got two. he's got two down. eyes. Yeah, but they like connect in the middle. And mm -hmm. just the brow goes brown, down yeah. and up. Yeah, that's it. I and mean, like, the important thing is at the end of the day, we Jack, have, we you have to take need a to stop burping. Why is it so That's fine, so just bad. keep burping, don't worry about it. But <laughs> anyway, I, whatever. I yeah, mean, right. I'm gonna see the goddamn movie anyway. Sorry. Um, but yeah, apparently they're gonna they're gonna fuck him up somehow. They're gonna change him. Look, come on! Look at that! See, he's got 
a big eye. No, you're right. He's got goggle now face. He looks goggle more like face. He's got like snow. They're gonna dump the teeth. Face. Supposedly, they're gonna dump the, the teeth. Are gonna be easy, but like, how else? What do you change anything? Dude, but it's yeah, how? I think if they dump the teeth and they skinny up the legs, they, they got it. They're probably okay. Also, he's wearing gloves in the cartoon. He's got the, that's he's just furry hands. It's also the problem is yeah, his arms are pale, and in the movie they're not. They're all blue, which makes no sense. Like he's I, supposed to I have. I think the newer Sonic might have blue arms. Fuck the newer Sonic. Well, here's right. the thing. He I looks, want Urkel Sonic. He looks like a human. Eating chili dogs. It'll, out with it'll make sense by like the Jaleel sequel White. to Sonic when he's kissing the human. You stop. <laughs> but I'll tell you what: if you're a fan of Sonic and you're a fan of comedy, check out next week's GTA Five. Yeah, that's oh, all yeah, I'm saying. Yeah. Also, Boy, yeah, someone put out this I'm weekend. Saying, Sonic GTA 5. This weekend for first, <laughs> if you're watching this live as a first member, obviously you can watch it. What is it? It's Saturday. It goes yeah, up. Yeah, Saturday. Yeah. Uh, here's here. Let me let me explain the timeline. <laughs> I woke up, I checked my phone, the Sonic trailer was out. It was like 30 minutes, and I was like, fuck me. I walked into work, and I was like, e you fucking see the Sonic trailer? I hadn't seen Nobody it. Nobody watched it, so we watched it multiple times in the office. <laughs> well, I put it on my computer, and I don't have sound. You have so. the sound, it bounced around. <laughs> we watched it a bunch of times. Then, you know, meetings happened, people, people went their separate ways. We sat there, we talked about what we need to film today, and someone's like, hey, we need GTA. And I just went, Sonic. Then that video happened. Yep, and then, then the video happened. happened. So, that happened. Then we film if you, something if else. If you love it or you don't, that's on it's me. It's going to be a polarizing one. Yeah, it's so gonna pull gonna back the curtain a bit. We took bets on what percentage <laughs> of likes this video would have. <laughs> but, yeah. but, 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 but we, the, 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 there was one main focus, and it was we had to go fast. Had and I fast. feel like we established that. Yes. And we we pulled it off. And emeralds. We needed so emeralds. So so emeralds. Right. It's, it's Ashley, me, you, me, Trevor. Me. Jack, uh, Ryan, Ryan, Lindsay, Lindsay. And Lindsay. Okay. That's the six of us. Uh, and to be fair, we took bets on the like dislike ratio of this video after we shot it. Yep. Um, and before then, Ashley's editing. But then I've seen Ashley's edits on it so far, and I feel like that throws it out the window. It's like ten times because they're amazing. With, Ashley, with what Ashley she took done. the garbage, the hot steaming pile of garbage we handed her, and she fucking made lemonade out of it. Yeah. Garbage lemonade. I'm halfway there. It's <laughs> dude. It's really funny. We shot a fucking live action intro yeah, we did. today, squeezed it in the last second. So uh, I highly implore you to watch this. So that's how. And if first you don't like members, it, tell us never do it again. You being first members watching this right now, GTA for first members comes out Saturday. I think it's tomorrow, right? I think it's tomorrow, yeah. yeah. I said yes, Sunday, yes. and someone screamed at me because no. I think it goes. It goes I didn't Saturday. Scream, it, was it goes me. I didn't Saturday. You know, it goes Saturday <laughs> first. I Sunday so. site. Monday YouTube. Monday YouTube. Yeah. Right. I'm just saying, strap in, put on your red shoes, get some chili dogs. Yeah. Who got painted blue to be Sonic? Well, it wasn't, we weren't painted necessarily. We we're, paint not, we're not racist. Okay? Speaking of painting people, someone on AWU sent us. Um, Does it look like that? It looks uh, evil. This was on the last AWU, the most recent one. You're on AWU. It was like a little cup of latex body paint? Oh, oh yeah, the, the, like, the, cum, the cum cup. Yeah, dude. First off, it was stinky. Smells. And this is the second so. thing I've said on Awu that smells exactly like this. It smells like power bait, fish bait. Like, so you, you said know, that you fish, disgusting. and I know what you know. What you I'm said, talking I know about. exactly. I know. Yes. I know that smell right now. Like the right fake, now. like marshmallowy looking fish bait. It smells exactly like it. Uh, smeared it all over Gavin's arm. I went nuts on it. Um, because yeah, someone. Yeah. And maybe this was Gavin. Someone said stinky pussy. Gavin said that. that. Was Gavin. Gavin said yeah. it smells like... I didn't like, get that. It's, Did you say old stinky pussy? It smells like old pussy, is what he said, yeah. yeah. Um, and then, <laughs> so I went full in on it, smeared it on Gavin's arm. But what I didn't realize is, they said it's latex oh, yeah, body so like paint. It, it so hardens. therefore, it hardens into essentially like a latex suit. But Gavin's a very hairy person. Hairy as shit. Um, and my... God, I have a video on my phone. I don't know where it's gonna go, but I have a video on my phone of him taking that stuff off. His his arm was fucking smooth. After Dude, that. I walked over and Fiona is pulling like blue or purple paint it's, off yeah, of him. Purple, yeah. And I'm like, what are you guys doing? And you're like, oh, it's all caught up in his hair. We're ripping it off. And Gavin's like playing to the camera. I think you're filming him. I just walked over and I was like, I'll help. I grabbed his wrist. I just started ripping chunks of his arm hair like, off. No paint. Nowhere on near it. the paint. Yeah. For as long as I could until he was like, what the fuck? 
and I yeah. got I got four or five good pulls. I think it's all my fault. Jess just walks Jesus. up, starts pulling Gavin's hair out of his over <laughs> like no he's pain got a lot attack. That's what he gets though. We got it in early because now he's Vic? he's been gone. Now he's gone. He's, he's gone, gone for like, for like two, two weeks. weeks. Yeah. yeah, he's gone yeah. to recuperate. Yeah. What an ass. <laughs> I feel like there was something. Yeah, was no weird. Weird. Yeah, I feel like, like there was something that. we were specifically waiting for him for as well. Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, I was gonna break this bottle over his head. Well, we, he's in World War Z. He's part of he's part of that, that the Z crew or whatever. That's a f dude. Surprisingly you know what crew fun hasn't game. been around so in a while, good. Michael. We need to fix that. Yeah. The Yoruru crew. When's okay, the last tell time Matt to come to work. Done something? Matt is at work today. Yeah. yeah but I just we haven't filmed it. Guess what? I'm not here next week. Fuck. I got uh, my anniversary is next week. Mm -hmm. Five years. Five years. Hey, oh, congrats, Michael. Congrats. Um, don't, 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 don't patronize me. Jesus Shut Christ. Up. Someone was clapping wearing gloves. Yeah, that was, it was a good. Clap. It was, the so it it was, was like, Sonic. It was. <laughs> it was the softest clap I've ever heard. What a sound. Um, also, with our anniversary, death. So we have a memorial to go to. <laughs> good. Um, it's just gonna, not it's, typical. It ruined it. It's yeah. going to eat up the whole week. Congratulations. We a, I, yeah. I booked a hotel, had the whole thing planned. Someone went and died and ruined it. So then I had to move it. It was pretty gauche of them, I thought. Um, but basically the whole week is shot. Mm. So I'm here Monday. And then I'm fucked the rest of the week. I mean, Damn. Tuesday, Wednesday, I'll be fucked. Like, and, getting drunk and being like, woo, five years, we well, did it. I mean, a rumor Monday. crew could get back together on Monday. We, we could, it won't. It won't, but we got other shit. Mondays to do are already super Monday. busy. Let's How? stream. Wow, two whole what, things. What's the stream? <laughs> there, there's there's both of them. Mondays. Oh yes, our sponsor streams on Monday. Those are on Mondays now. We used to do those on Wednesdays, and now they're Mondays. I That's true. I, I might be. Hey, also, if you're Monday. curious, um, gameplay, let's play, live action achievement hunter. People. Still haven't gotten That's what has happened. the PSA on that. It's happened. Have Trevor's mentioned, mentioned, it, Trevor's mentioned it as much as possible. I don't think it's come up on the Oh, it's come up a lot. But we've basically, we, we've separated the content now where any live action show is on Achievement Hunter, any gameplay shit is on Let's Play. So like Play Pals, Let's Play. Let's Watch. Rage Quits coming out. Let's Play. Let's Play. Yep. Uh, between the games, Achievement Hunter. Battle Buddies. Tea Party's all coming back. All that crap. Let's Play. Well, Battle, Buddy, Battle, Battle Buddies is canceled, right? No, we just don't make it. So what, what's, on <laughs> what's on Achievement Hunter then? Hey, uh, so said live action. Awu. Got, okay, Awu. Awu shows. Between, between the games. Between the games. Uh, Ready, set, show is on there. Uh, they have best ofs, I think, go on there. Animated stuff goes on there. This show, off topic. Off topic goes on there. Fridays. Um, and then it's there's probably, something. It's Saturdays, I'm missing something else. I don't know what it is. If you see us as humans, Achievement Hunter. Let's roll. Let's roll is on there. Yeah. Um, if there's a human being in the goddamn shot, it's on Achievement Hunter. What about Shane? Yeah. Shut the fuck up. I got, what about I got no idea. <laughs> let's watch this. Let's play. Okay. Play let's watch this. But, but there's people, yeah, but, it's a, but it's a video. If there's humans only. Okay. Let me hey, tell you that. Eric, yeah. I just sent no, you a disappointing no slack. Game. I'm sorry. For I really it. wanted to do it. I was looking forward to it. I had a bunch of stuff prepped, but I'm going to I'll probably have to reschedule. It's fine. Oh, oh what so oh, 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 is Eric? I'll have to answer. reschedule now. Oh, oh. Eric. Hey, I'll tell you this. I just yeah. have to be a good dad. Hey, good on you. Thanks. Nice. I'll tell you yeah, this. No, I'm going okay. to fire off. We were supposed to film it today, but people didn't show up to work like assholes. I was one of them. Um, I was here. But Monday, my nanny uh -oh. fucked me, but not like sexually, just time wise. Oh, you could have um, been like Schwarzenegger. No. No, that was his. Or. That was his housekeeper. No, that was his housekeeper. Jude Law fucked his nanny. Um, have you seen the love child? Mm -hmm. He's my, graduated college. Dude, he looks just like him. He yeah. looks and he does all the poses. He does all He's the Arnold insane. poses and it's shit. It's awesome. Yeah. yeah to be mini Arnold. Arnold owned up to that. I'll give him I'll give him props for that. It's, it's shitty to like, you know, have an affair and good on him, life. man. But like he had a kid and he's taking good on care him. of the kid. And the thing is too, like when you're when you're married to like a Kennedy, you might die. So Well, he's in the public eye. In his defense, every now and again, you know, you see people with like they have affairs and stuff. There's a kid, and they're like, maybe this is their kid. And they're like, no, it doesn't look like me. It's that. This is Arnold, yeah, yeah. It's young his, Arnold. It's his little clone. Yeah. Apparently, um, his oh. uh, the other kids uh, with his wife, hate the, that the, the legitimate Shriver. kids are real shitty to that kid and hate him and tr treat him like shit. Oh, that's that's awesome. I bet he's a great guy. It's, it's not the fault. kid's fault. It's not the kid's it's fault. It's Arnie's yeah. fault. Yeah. yeah. And, can, and his, by the way, we and call his, him the kid, but how old is he now? He's like he's graduated college. And Arnold's melted neck. Yeah. It's melted. <laughs> and we got off topic. Anyways, anymore. Monday. But that's the name of the show. Monday. That's we're Monday, saying. we're shooting the fucking sequel to Red Dragon Inn. <gasps> the, return the, the return of Gherky. The return. 
Oh, and that's man. and to be fair, I want to get this on the record here. Um, you've been getting slammed I got a lot slammed. lately. I got really da, da, slammed lately. And this was a hard slam. Yeah. Da, da, da. So, I don't know what you're saying. I would say the, the first, first slam was, was Lindsay. Jeremy, Jeremy in the last slam. week or two. It's naughty by nature, right? Not, is it naughty by nature? Slam! Jeremy da, da, in the last da, week or da, two da, has been talking about getting Biohazard slammed in yeah, the office. And that's usually Alfredo or Matt's position mm -hmm. to get what? slammed. Yeah. Get slammed. It was from Judgment Night, I think. It was when like you put like a grunge band and a hip hop artist together. Wasn't it? He's not listening. He's on his phone. Yeah. He's, I'm he's, looking it up. He's, he's he's buying groceries right now. No, he's playing Assassin's Creed. Yeah, that's no true. Onyx. Yeah. Onyx, um, that's it, yeah. Onyx and Biohazard together, I think. But Jeremy was getting slammed a lot. There was a drawing on the whiteboard that was, Lindsay drew a picture of Jeremy. Which Jeremy. Is like, which is like <laughs> a <laughs> crushed neck Jeremy. It was Jeremy yeah. like it this. It was me like, with no neck, like, you know Michael does the thing? <laughs> like, he does that where he sucks his chin. But also, I've got the the... This right, and, but it was both happening at the same time, which you, I can't the physically head do. It looks like the you got neck. I've got the head roll. It's like then, someone yeah. hit you with a big mallet yeah. and crushed yeah. you a little right. bit. So you got that. Then uh, what happened after that? Then Fiona that got erased, again. and then Fiona drew another Jeremy, which was almost as insulting. You have like a beach ball, perfectly round head. Yeah, like a fat head. And it says, what did it say? It said, it said, it said, it said short. And angry, which isn't wrong. Damn. I know that that's not wrong. But you don't it's have to call. Ball, you don't have to call player. attention to it. And I will say, your head is very egg shaped. It's not round. Yeah, it's not like. Boom. Yeah, you know, it's. Uh, so then, those. so it was at those two points. Jeremy was like, "Why am I getting slammed? Everybody's slamming. Mm. Why am I getting slammed?" Oh, and then the Larry way. comes in, right? And he's oh. like. He's like, hey, Piss we're gonna buck. do we're gonna do Red Dragon in. And initially, I thought like only I was gonna be in it from the original crew because he was like, we want Gurky. I thought he was like Gurky. Gurky is like people, a fan favorite, right? and yeah. we're gonna get three new characters. So I took that as like, okay, it's whoever. It was, it was it was you, Jeff, and Ryan. Yes. Um, I just remember Ryan was Zot. Because Ryan was had, Zot. We had Jeff a lot was of Fiona, like, and we I had a was, lot of like head to head. I was the busty. Chip. And I'll be honest, I didn't win, but I felt like I won. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm fine with that. Um, but then I'm talking to Larry about it and he's like, yeah, so Jeremy's gonna be this guy And I was like, oh, I thought Jeremy wasn't in it. He's like, no, we're gonna get three new characters But like Jeremy's gonna be in it again. He's gonna be this guy and it was like some little dwarf character I think and his name was literally Dimwit the Dwarf. Yeah, and he was like, yeah, D Dimwit the Dwarf. It looks just like him. He's tiny. He's bald. <laughs> he's an idiot. That's gonna be Jeremy and I went then later he pitched that to you. He walked in and he was like, "Hey, this is gonna be." He you. was like, "Look at this guy. He's, He's like, just look at this like guy. you." Dimwit the dwarf. Look how <laughs> stupid he is. He looks just like you. That's you. And you were like, "Why are you slamming me? Why am I getting slammed?" So it's just been like a week, maybe Hard. even more than yeah, like, slamming like week. last week. Of dude, Con Jeremy just looks at me and goes, "Why am I getting slammed?" Why am I getting slammed? And I'm just like, I don't know. I was know, like, what man. did I do? I what did know, I man. do here? I don't know. But it just I happens. try to be nice. You've been, you've been getting it. Just hard. You know? I'll tell you what you do. I you head like a clock in first orange. every day. I come in first every day. With a good mood, a smile on your face, and an extra bang I bring in your hands. Here's a thanks for Jeff. And you bust your ass till 5 p.m. You don't need people like Larry coming in and just shitting in your mouth. But that's not cool. He's slamming. I don't need Larry taking this out on me. Larry, buddy. It's not your fault. Larry's a goddamn psycho serial killer. He is. Yeah. He, he really is. That has nothing to do with this, got but it's true. He's got bodies among bodies. His bodies hit the floor. Hey, Michael, I What's don't know up? about you, but I could really use a... Uh, I, I, I've, been, I've been having some smelly burps. I'm thinking maybe if I brush my teeth more than once That's a week... That's true. After you're done way consuming... I could solve that. If you're done consuming copious amounts of alcohol, mm -hmm. if you brush your teeth, make sure you get your tongue, because tongue yeah, is a, yeah. lot a lot of germs. Smell. I should do that the once a um, month I brush my teeth. You could use Quip. Oh. It's time for spring cleaning for your mouth. And Quip's got an easy way to get started with your brushing habits. Just two minutes, twice a day, can help pave the way to a healthier mouth and mind. And now the whole family can get refreshed with Quip. The new kids Quip has the same two minute timer and guiding pulses as their original version with no childish gimmicks so they can brush just like a grown up because that's what every kid wants. It wants to be all grown up like the Rugrats. The new brush is the same as Quip's original version, just tweaked for sized down mouths. Kids are inspired to brush better and more often with oral care that looks and feels like the products the adults in their life use, and they're proud to use Quip. Quip uses sensitive sonic vibrations for an effective clean that's gentle on your gums. With traditional toothbrushes, people can brush too hard, and some electric toothbrushes are too abrasive. Quip is great. I love using it. I know it's cleaning my mouth effectively, and it's way better than using a traditional toothbrush. That's why I love Quip and why over one million happy, healthy mouths do too. 
Quip starts at just $25. And if you go to getquip.com slash off topic right now, you can get your first refill pack for free. That's your first refill pack for free at getquip.com slash off topic. Get quip, get clean, and get gone. There you go. Mm. Get, get that get that bad breath gone. Get that stink. Make sure you brush your tongue. Tongue is where most of your stink comes from. It's, it's true. true. It's true. It's much healthier I, than I had to get some menus. food in me after this. I uh, I don't normally eat at work. I did recently well, for you do. it's the best time to eat for ready set show. I try not to eat at work. You sometimes will do your Michael thing. I haven't done it in a while. No, you brought kolaches in a little while ago. That hit me hard. That's here's the thing. There's Michael bringing in food, going there it is, and then there's Michael bringing in food, going Jeremy. There's both. I haven't done that in a while. You haven't done that in a while. Yeah, if I bring in food and leave it there and walk away and you eat it, that's on you. But okay? I've been good about like you take that to your grave. Don't I've been pin good that about on me, like Stephanie going, going, "Hey, we're getting shit. Panda Express today," and I'm like, "Don't get me anything." Stuff like that. See, my my thing, I like I like eating at work when I leave the office. Like we sit in that room all day, and I like getting out of the office just for a little bit. Just I'll just, sometimes just walk to H E B to get hours. like a salad or something. Yeah. Just <laughs> that's very Bruce Green of you. Um, but we recently ate a bunch of stuff on Ready Set Show. So we're three episodes out on Ready Set Show right now. And uh we're here's the thing. Eating stuff, especially gross stuff, that gets views. And we know that. But we don't want that to be what the show is. No, nah, make it the show. <laughs> like make every the episode. Show. Eating, now I want that. You did some of you did some of the food yesterday. It was fucking brilliant. Yes, and that's the thing with that episode. The unfortunate thing is that episode's losing. not out for Jeremy's like three it. weeks. Well, why are you talking about it, nerd? Because it's so awesome! It well, the awesome. next episode's really good, too, because the next episode has Gavin in it. So it's me, Trevor, and Gavin on the show. Um, and, yeah, we, like, we did a whole episode where we like kind of did a Gavinisms-based episode where, you know, we try to guess what words he's making up and stuff like that. You just wanted rude to waiters and stuff and wanted to sign hats. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I mean, Dude, he's an asshole. Hand that guy sign the fucking hat. If you hand that guy a hat, yeah, Jesus hat. Christ. But, like, we, we did that, but we did one recently with food. That I'll was, hand him a hat. Yeah, we, we I'll do it. You won't sign it. Yeah, so we're the new sign Elon Musk. Yeah, the food one is fucking awesome, dude. All right. All right. But. That's what he'll say. Watch that oh, show. I would On a Monday, for verse man. You're a very good friend of mine. Wow. Big Newton. Hell yeah. I've been watching a lot of, um... Studio Ghibli films, and cool. Alfredo's been coming over to watch them. We watched Totoro yesterday. Totoro. That was a good movie. A it's good, but it was not at all what I would thought. <laughs> I totally, <laughs> let me tell you, Totoro, totally he's forgot. not the star of the show. He doesn't <laughs> not really do anything. I don't <laughs> understand. He's barely in How the did show. he get all the credit? Because he's marketable. I don't understand, because I've seen all those movies. He's too. also scary. He screams in children's faces. I was expecting like, what's the name? What's the name of the cat bus? Cat bus. Here's cat bus. Okay, cat that's what I kept calling it. J J cat bus is the star of the goddamn movie. Fucking there should be a song about cat bus. There should be cat bus merchandise. Fuck Totoro. Totoro doesn't do shit. Here's what Totoro does. But Totoro Let me call cooler, Cat Bus. I don't That's understand. it. I don't about the egg horns. Jeremy yesterday described Cat Bus as a bus made out of cat. It's a cat that is a it's bus. Not, no, it's a cat <laughs> that is a bus. It's not a bus made out of a cat. And the motherfucker can morph himself to like make a door and people get on. And he goes on the power line. Here's what happens. He can also go wherever he wants. Here's what happens. Mako's missing again because their father sucks ass and he's the worst fucking parent Tim ever. Daly. And fucking Totoro calls up Cat Bus and says, hey, can you find this kid? And then Cat Bus rolls up and it goes ding, 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 May, M-E-I. That's where she is. Fucking Dakota Fanning, whatever goddamn character's name is, hops on the bus and it goes right to it. Why the fuck is there a song about Totoro at the end? Let's sing about Cat Bus. Tell, tell no, bro. that would have happened, bro. Him. That kid would have been dead. Also, her shoe was in the swamp. Did she drown? Right, is she a ghost now? We don't know. this night. Who who watched this movie? It was it was me, Jackie, Alfredo, Lindsay, Andy, and Fiona. Had anyone not seen it before? I uh, haven't yeah. seen it. Uh, I saw it like ten I don't years think ago. Andy saw it, and Jackie didn't see did it. Did anyone yeah. jump? Jackie saw. Did it anyone jump at the point where the girl puts her finger in the crack in the wall and all the dust bunnies come flying? No, down? no, because we're, we're a fucking adult. What? That scared the shit out of me when I was a kid. What the fuck? Well, we're not kids though. We're yeah, but you 31. can be in her kids. You're watching <laughs> Totoro together. I was we're watching Totoro, and, and be honest, like lights. all of the 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 circle jerkness of Totoro, I was expecting a lot, and it didn't. Deliver. He was barely in the movie. Cat Bus. I agree. Cat Here's Bus the was the star of the movie. 
How did he, I don't understand it. For the last it. 30 fucking years. I don't get it. Long, you, people talk about Studio Ghibli and they talk about Miyazaki films. And I like them all. I've seen them all. I have a daughter. She's 13. All? There's like 22. I've seen a ton of them. I've seen I'm, everything up to like. I'm trying to watch them all. I've seen everything up to. Is Ponyo the newest one? Howl's Moving Castle or whatever. Uh, I've seen I, five, I saw Ponyo, so, so I saw that one too. Ponyo, but anyway. Ponyo's Little Mermaid. Right? Um, I've got Ponyo. Okay. I'm watching but it. out of all those, like, I don't understand why Totoro is the one that captured everyone's imagination. Even, even and he's like, like the Japanese Mickey Mouse. Right. And, yeah. I, like, Porco Rosu is way better. Kiki's Delivery Service, way I better. I already Castle, watched Howl. Pablo Yostro, Shut up. Way better. There's so I mean, Where just because I mean, Totoro's a good movie. Don't get me wrong. I don't want to talk shit. I'm not talking shit on Totoro. When it was I just don't think it's the best of the bunch. And not only and there's that, so many other of his films that I think. Not are only cooler. that, I'm like, just saying Totoro was good, but Totoro himself is nothing. He's in the movie for like five minutes. Yeah. He's sleeping. He doesn't do shit. He sleeps and he screams in children's faces. He's like Godzilla. He just goes. Bruh. You know what he sounds like? Like, like? You know what he sounds also, like? He sounds like. Thing. Have y'all seen Us? No, I haven't seen yes. it. He sounds like when the people in Us speak. Oh, yeah. Like when the husband speaks, yeah, he's yeah. like, oh. Also, oh. I'm gonna throw this out there, right? Yeah. I couldn't be bothered to like go back and, and find the scene in the movie as I was watching it. But goddamn, if Totoro did not 30 years ago, I think it was 88, came out, 88 or 89? 88, 88, 89. 30 years ago, there's a scene where, I think it's May, I think it's the younger sister, it's mm -hmm. gonna be. is drawing is drawing Totoro, she fucking drew 2019 Sonic. <laughs> There's a scene in the movie where like, I just yeah, go, blue crayon. she's drawing Sonic! And it's blue crayon, and it's like a fucked up head, and he's got spikes in his it head. Was, like, I gotta was. go back and take the picture and post it on Instagram so I can get all the likes. Oh, yeah. Style. Get that clout. Get Before, that clout. You, you can't see how many likes you get anymore. No, I, I'm gonna, I'll tell you. I'll tell you how many I got. Well, you can't see. No, them. you can't see. They're taking them out. Well, they're getting the likes. How about right now? What? Can I see them right now? Oh, wait, on, wait. On then I'm gonna do it. Can you see your? No, 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 no. How will I know my posts are getting hot? I'm pretty sure you can see it. I think, quiet you. I think, I think you can see it. Okay, I don't know the full extent. I think it's the poster can see it, but that's it. I'm pretty sure. Why? And but like, if you look at it, you don't see. Instagram game. Listen, the point is. She fucking draws 2019 Sonic. The fuck do you? 30 years you ahead of time. You and I basketball and I have a scoreboard. So she drew Cyclops and just fucking It's very it? I'm, I swear to God, pull it up, find it. You won't be able to find the scene because it's just like in the middle of the movie and it's when she's like in school or some we'll shit. Find it like that. that dad sucks. I hate him. What what He's cartoon, like, well, what no cartoon wonder, parents wonder, are wonder. good? Timmy like, Turner's dad. Like, are there there's so many Love shitty them. cartoon character parents? Like, yeah. well, like well, okay, how about, how about Andy's dad in Toy Story? He's just gone. We never see him. What about the well, he's dead. It's it's like his is he though? He's dead. Is he dead? I'm just saying. We don't know. Do maybe he's just a shitty Fenton. father. I love Danny Phantom so much. The maybe Fentons he's, are great. Maybe he's Jack out Fenton? fighting crime or something. We don't know that. I find Ghibli movies odd. No shit. They're weird <laughs> as fuck. <well. laughs> They're great though. They're super weird. Man, I hope nobody thinks that I we're talking shit about. Those movies are awesome. No, I, like I just don't get why Totoro is the one. That's I don't held up get how he's, Totoro and Mononoke are held the, up as like. I that. I just fully expect Totoro to be like be in the whole movie to be like this like big lovable kind of rabbit guy, and that was Cat Bus to me. Yeah, Cat Bus saved the goddamn day. It was True awesome. Uh, it was cool scene with Totoro and the girl standing at the bus stop in the rain. That was cool. That's very iconic. I was like, cool I've seen bird. that picture before. Um, <laughs> was it? Uh, but I'm watching. Uh, I've seen. Okay, so I saw Princess Mononoke like two years ago. That was the only one I've ever seen. And it's then, good. and then it hit me that that the Studio Ghibli films in general are doing this 2019 thing where they're in theaters. It's at Alamo. It's at AMC. And Stop, Lindsay Jack. and I, Jack's freaking. Lindsay and I were gonna see one, but we couldn't because of our bastard children. <laughs> it somehow picked up. Girl arguing is 2019. No, right. no. Well, she should stop. So lose that argument. I was like, listen, we can't go to the movies. Let's just do a Ghibli run at home. And I'm just gonna oh, like. Yeah, I've only movie. I've only ever seen one. Goofy movie. So let's just start buying good them time, up. Good so so far we've watched Spirited Away. It's okay. Um, it's all right. It's good. Not one of my it's favorites. Not my favorites. I watched Howl's Moving Castle, which I fucking love. It's pretty good. Good one. I liked someone, it a lot. Someone loves it. Um, yeah. Kiki's Delivery Service. Full right. confetti. Which you was know, very good. Delivery? But I was out. I see whatever you want. You know what's oh. interesting about Kiki's Delivery Service? I was delivery. outraged about the cat. I got power thing. Did you watch the yeah. dubbed version or the? Cat. I watched yeah. the dub, but what I learned too was now your fucking watch is freaking or your phone. I watched. That's the, what I figured. I watched the dub. Fuck. Um. 
I was outraged about about uh, Gigi the cat and what happened. Yeah. Um, and then I watched uh, Totoro. So I've seen five. Okay. So far. The next one we're gonna watch is Castle in the Sky. Okay. Because that's the last one Lindsay's seen. Then we've she's only seen six. Has so then I've seen all the ones she has, and then they're all new after that. Be sure to watch Castle Cogliostra. Okay. That's the I'm gonna loop, watch that's every the loop in the third one. I'm gonna watch every oh, okay. Yeah. Well that's technically not a Ghibli film. It's yeah, a but Miyazaki I, film. But Miyazaki made it. Yeah. So you should watch I'm it. I'm going Ghibli first. Okay. Which is mostly Miyazaki. Yeah, he's, done, yeah. he's done like half their movies, you if mean not more. Graveyard for Fireflies, or is Field of the Fireflies different from Graveyard? There's some for sort of Fireflies. It's an Owl City song. That people keep going on about. Um, that's song that's too. Yeah. Neither, and it's just sad and don't watch it. Yeah, it's face melting or something, is what I hear. Um, but the next one is <laughs> Castle in the <laughs> Sky, <laughs> and then it's like open season oh, after. Yeah. I bought like a dozen, and then as we watch all of them, I'm gonna buy more. Mm. So um, I like it, I'm into it. I'm just watching all Ghibli. People Calm keep down. freaking out about Miyazaki. So many people have recommended the Lupin movie, which I, I really like. That I mean, Lupin I like. It's just fun. I like the series. It's a great fucking series. Yeah. It's just like a heist show. Lu Lupin the Third. It's so fun. So like also, as you know, Lupin the Third voice ties Sonny Strait, who does uh, Krillin from Dragon Ball Z. So that's cool. I like him. It's probably, it's probably it's probably not in the movie because yeah. mo movie rights are always different. That's my Halloween from television show right? Six dots. Grave of the Fireflies. Nothing. I didn't say anything. All right. You look like you wanted to. You gotta shave all this though if you're gonna be curling. I almost shaved all of this for the thing that we filmed today. You should have. I'm that close to shaving. <laughs> I think we filmed it. It was so fucking stupid. It, uh, it's also it so 17 good. seconds. Yeah. Yeah. So it would have been amazing if you shaved your whole face for it. I mean, dedication. And, and I really thought because like my sister's wedding is in a month, but I'm like, it would be back by then. We have to be back by oh, yeah, a month. Here's the other thing that like just is just annoying, which is like, fine. If you ask for recommendations, great. If you say, what should I watch? Great. I, I've made it very clear on social media, Twitter, Instagram, like, hey, I've only seen one Ghibli film. Fuck it. Lindsay and I are just going to watch all the Ghibli movies. And motherfuckers won't stop recommending movies that aren't Ghibli films. I'm like, I don't care. I don't give a shit. And they're like, it's not Ghibli, but you should watch this anime. And I'm just like, I've seen anime. I watch anime all the time. Right. That has nothing to do with what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm watching all of the Ghibli films. Hey, you should watch Ghost in the Shell. Great, thanks. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Great. I don't give a shit. I'm not asking you. It's like it's like when I post gym shit. Like this is my routine. This is what I'm drinking. Oh, you should do this. I don't give a fuck what you yeah, think. This is Go what I'm fuck doing. yourself. I've, I've done if I ask for I'm advice, doing. if I'm saying, hey, give me some tips. That's give true. me some, shut the fuck up. I don't care. I don't give a shit. Keep it to yourself. Do whatever the fuck you, you want. You and I both yeah. got wait something in, recently. Wait until I ask. Because you were talking about this kind of recently, <laughs> where you were being an idiot during Awu, and I was doing a similar thing in like the most recent Awu, I think. Like, someone pointed out the weights that were sitting there. You got like the both flex adjustable. It was the one when Fiona poured beer all well, over. Well, yeah, that's the one you were talking about. And on the most recent one, I like, we're talking about the weights, and I pick it up, and I'm still reading the stuff, and I'm just like, you know, doing this like while I'm reading. I was like, oh, you know, well, well, just stuff like that. And like, of course, like some comments like, man, Jeremy with that form, if he's like trying to, you know, if he's really trying to get gains, he can't be doing them like that. I'm like, I'm reading an ad <laughs> read while I'm like, <laughs> I was doing, like, like, what the fuck I was, do you think? I was lifting weights on the bench in the background as Fiona poured beer into my mouth. Yeah. And someone's like, oh, why don't you do a little less weight and work on your form? <laughs> And I was like, like, you're a moron. You're an idiot. Like, <laughs> you're an if you comment idiot. that, you literally have a problem. Especially like, when like, we stand up and go, do you do you do it, me? Yeah. And they're like, that's just wrong. Yeah. That's incorrect. God. People, you know, the people want to give their opinions on stuff. They're very opinionated. <laughs> Dude, I get that shit all the time when I'm playing. Well, because like, you're fat. Well, <laughs> yeah. Do I look like Matt to you? <laughs> He's, I mean, he's not, on he's it. a lot of things. That, that, fucking, that boy was already in the chamber before you started talking. It's just... Oh, dude, you that, should, while you're watching Studio Ghibli films, you should try Cowboy Bebop. That's anime. <laughs> yeah. Paul doing, God Paul damn, doing, dude. Paul doing neckies. What the dude? Oh, I heard you, I you're, I heard you're, you're working through all the Studio Ghibli films. Let me tell you about some martial arts films I like. You should also watch them. You know who Sonny Chiba is? Hey, Has hey. nothing to do with Studio Ghibli. You'll love it. Drunken Master, man. Check I it out. Studio it's Ghibli. It's like... Okay, great. 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 Awesome. Cool. Well, here's the thing. Like, I really... I, I had a like salad for lunch that, today. I don't ever want to be that person that, like, will mm. say say something and then, like, I really don't have the backing to, like, go behind the things sure. that I'm saying. Which is why, specifically, I started 
I've, I've been reading through the whole of the oh, Mueller the, report. The Mueller report. I yeah. walked in today and Jeremy goes, this is my reading material. And it was just all crap. He's like, like 100 pages, 150. I looked at it and yeah. I was like, yeah, I'm 130 what is pages this? in Because right it was now. all just legal jargon. He's like, that is a Mueller report. Because I do find it really Mueller. interesting. Mueller. And like, you know, every Mueller now and again, report. I'll joke about it. And people are like, well, you know, typical. He's just following what the media says. So I'm like, no, I, I like to... I like to do my research and read from very various different places. By the way, Man. <laughs> political or not, it's worth a read if you're into that kind of yeah. stuff. You know what I mean? Like, regardless yeah, of what probably, sides we're on, it's it's just worth reading. Like, you reading it has been all the motivation I need. We've got different political opinions here, obviously. Yeah. No, li <laughs> right. literally, like, the president aside, even just reading about, like, the social media aspect of what, like, Russia was doing and stuff like that, it's crazy oh, it's when you read it. Like, oh my god! You're taking a break from InfoWars to read something different. Yeah, you know? Well, to be fair, that's where you found it's, the link. Well, it's hard to follow. No, it's, it's, it's interesting, because I've been talking, we actually did trivia the other day, I was talking about how I'm starting to feel real dumb, because I haven't read any in 2019. Mm -hmm. Like, I read one book in January, I haven't read anything since, I've been focusing on other stuff. And, uh, you reading the Mueller report, I was like, fuck, if Jeremy's gonna read it, why haven't I read it? I feel really dumb about myself. And I was like, you should. Yeah, so I gotta read it. Uh, no, it's definitely worth the read. The first sixty pages are far more interesting than the second sixty pages yeah. <laughs> so far. But uh, it's it's worth it if you're into that kind of stuff. If not, man, then, Jeremy you know, can read. Yeah. If not, get it from a few different. Jeremy places. was never the questionable about reading. He can read fine. I know, Trevor, just somebody in the crowd. No, I know. As I'm saying, Trevor yeah. is another story. Trevor. And Every time that guy <laughs> picks up a letter in Awu, I weep. I know. And he goes, "Hold on, they wrote it wrong." <laughs> it's, yeah, it's bad. I'm just saying. But Dude, we had a fucking great lunch today. We went we to go get burritos and we talked about Marvel comics the whole time. We did. I downloaded a bunch of comic guys. Yeah. 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 It's not a bunch I of picked up Marvel and comics. After I got Unlimited and, and the DC one and then like comic and mixology the and yeah. image one as well. Image one is going to be yeah. great if I'm you want to read like that. Saga Invincible. I'm going to Hitter again next iPad Mini. Just download a bunch of comics. But I won't invite you. You don't mind reading them on your iPad Mini? No, I love it. Because I have an iPad Mini as well. I was afraid it'd be too small. I was thinking about getting an iPad Pro. Well, because I'm someday because I'm fucking broke. You have the, you have the option of zooming in so it like cinematically goes from slate to slate. <gasps> it's beautiful. Oh, and I just I go find my iPad. I'm, I just lay down. I'm just like, oh. where would that? You live? jerking off or something? Nope. Oh, I'm okay. just laying with, uh. You had one hand in your. Look, crotch. I'm already getting ahead of the fact that Michael's gonna call me fat, so I was just like, I'm making everyone noises, does. You know. Yeah. So. That's true. I get it at home too. <laughs> Eric's still here. <laughs> He's around. Him giggling in there. What are you doing? I'm sitting here. He's making fart noises with your mouth. Yeah. Jeff, are you yeah. excited at all about Austin FC? What did you just say? Yeah. The yeah. ML Austin's I, I, MLS team. The, yeah. the, the first official billboard for, for Austin sure. FC went up. I've actually been branching out with my sports because I've you know I've been like fucking oh, super sports. obsessed with basketball my whole life, but more so the last few oh, years. Cornwall. I've watched every playoff game so oh, yeah. far. Of, uh, every playoff game for every series. I decided to get into hockey. Eric, get your own show. So I decided. Oh, I decided because the Bruins are in the playoffs, and I'm, you know, because there's an overlap between the Celtics and the Bruins Fat and playoffs. Brain. I thought <laughs> right. I'm, I'm already going to be in Boston going to playoff games. What if I just get into the Bruins and I can clever. double dip and I can yeah. see the Bruins on one night, Celtics on the other, just live at the Garden. Cool. And so finally, I pulled off the bandaid and decided I was going to learn hockey and force myself to enjoy it. it turns out. It's phenomenal, Dude, and it took me about 30 minutes to get the hang of it, and I'll be honest with you, the hardest thing and the, the barrier to entry for me for hockey was that I could not follow the puck. Oh, really? And after watching a full game, your eye trains to follow yeah. it, and now that I understand everything that's going on, and hockey is awesome. I remember about five years ago, I took you, you to went, a playoff you know, hockey to a, game. Yeah, we sat on the glass. We yeah, right on the glass. That was a, that was a blast. If you ever want to go to see a Texas Star game, it'd be a lot of fun. Absolutely. Yeah. So but, yeah, I'm a hockey fan wait, now. Wait, so, but I, well, I would, I'm absolutely excited about yeah, that. Yeah, I mean, the, I mean, it's funny because Katie actually likes hockey because Katie was a big fan of soccer. She grew up in mm -hmm. Australia, and soccer is big over there. And hockey and soccer are actually very similar in that it's, it's constantly moving. It's there's no really stopping. You know, offsides makes it like it's all kind of like similar stuff. Icing and, and soccer. Exactly. Know. And so I'm actually I'm genuinely excited about MLS coming off. So wait, yeah, I, me too. I it's it's not question. terribly far from here. It's not NBA, so. but it's something. Quick yeah. hockey question. Yeah. 
So why is it that sometimes the goalie isn't there? Is it because it's like final minutes and then they get another so play? If, they, if there's can, like okay. in a power play or whatever, they can pull the goalie. Well, no, no, okay, so you, okay, you have to have, you can have six players on your team on the ice at any time. Yeah. That that six players can be any players you want. If you yeah. want six offensive guys, you can have it. Yeah, that's not when have they a pull the goalie, put you can't, I don't think you can have more than one goalie, obviously, but... If, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. If, 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 you got five goalies. Dude, it's just five of them in the <laughs> oh. net. That's crammed but in there. You got five goalies and happy Gilmore. That's my career yeah. move. So, but say for, say for example, your team's down. It's like you're, you're three to two. There's one minute left. Yeah. You're gonna pull your goalie to throw another offensive guy out there to hopefully yeah. get an advantage to okay, score. Okay, that's what I thought. And so, but that'll I happen. Where it's I like never pull a goalie. into it. Yeah, yeah but it leaves yeah. your goal wide open. That means, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, then if yeah, the other team gets it, there. That's what I thought it was. Don't, yeah. All right, uh, chat, don't get crazy. It's not as good. The hockey's good. It's not as good as basketball, but it's good. Although that <laughs> fucking Bruins game last night was awesome. Dude, I'm excited but for football. The Philly, the Philly game last night was awesome, too. Man, draft has like happened. Football draft has happened. What's that? Football draft has happened. Oh, uh, yeah. It's like, I'm looking Jeez. forward. <laughs> they let them, and then they're like, whoa, whoa stop. None that of y'all none of y'all saw the what? windmill dunk that Embiid did in-game in the fourth quarter last night, did no. you? That was pretty fucking cool. And then he was like, being a prick. I love that dude. dude. Yeah. Jack, I love, I love dudes uh, that are pricks. When we went, we got like kind of brunch recently, you, mm -hmm. me, Kat, and Katie, and like yeah. Katie during it was talking about that you went to a hockey game, and she's like, they just have a lust for blood. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> People just wailing, the gloves Dude. come off, and they she's start like, they just want to see bl blood. Oh, 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 no, you're talking about the fans. Oh, yeah, the oh, fans. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Oh, the yeah. fans. People like, get just slammed like, against the fucking glass and shit. Oh, being yeah. on the glass is so much fun. It's awesome. It's so much fun. But, uh, but yeah, we have, we have the Texas I like stars to go here to hockey games and throw in brass knuckles. Like, yeah. 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 <laughs> throw in a mace. Use it. But yeah, the, te Use the Texas the stars are the Dallas. It's the Dallas Stars farm team. So it's basically like in baseball, they've got like you know farm teams. So like we have the the, the Texas like, or the we have the Round Rock Express, which is the Astros farm team. So like if a player gets injured and they need to kind of like work their way back up, they'll start in the smaller teams and then work their way back to the pros. So the Texas Stars is the Dallas Stars' is like rookie team, essentially. Or like Texas injured players will go there. Stars. And then if they need to pull a player, they'll pull from there. So it's I mean it's good because they're like legit players and it's fun. And it's small arenas and cool. So just so people stop asking. Oh my god, I love Kat. That was Kat was Katie that said that. Come on. Just uh, just so people stop asking, I'm rooting for Portland, I'm rooting for Philly, obviously I'm rooting for Boston, and I'm rooting for Houston. Ditto. Oh. And yeah. Golden State. Also, like, I don't watch really any sports or care at all, but everyone's saying NHL is the best. Um, That's pretty good. It's not well, as good. WWE the, the, the best. numbers disagree. Yeah. <laughs> I, just, I, I, I think as far as a product it's goes, not really if my, you, if it's, not, it's not really my opinion. Yeah, if I think, you I think it's the best, you should watch the fucking videos. <laughs> I think as far as a product go, I think the NFL is the best product, like the best like thing to watch on TV. Totally disagree. Basketball is fantastic, but I think the problem with basketball, there's so many games that they don't have as much impact. NFL, if you lose three also, games, you're out for the shit ton of games. Here's what I'll say too: if you yeah, baseball, add, baseball too, I would add tackling that. into NBA, that'd be intense. <laughs> well, there's a fair oh. amount of it. There's, there's a lot of I flopping mean, in full, the NBA, or at least not as much. Like, these. Yeah. like you got sacked. You brush a guy like, as much flopping as WWE. It's all flopping. I can't handle the starting and stopping of football. <laughs> As I get older, there's the, a lot of starting. The, the pro, the pros have actually gotten better about that. College is horrible about that. College is like every game's four hours long. The pros have pretty much got it down. To me, and again, this is like irrelevant because I don't really watch sports. But basketball to me is just like you scored, and now you scored, and now you scored, and now you scored, and, and with a lot scored. of squeaking and it just in goes between. on forever. Yeah, like so I like, I like, like hockey. At least it's like. There's a goal! It means a lot! Oh my god! Usually it's not like 87 to 70. Yeah, yeah. yeah but with basketball, it's like this it just, It's like this wave of momentum. Exactly. Like riding back and the forth. fact. It's so fucking cool. But I but will I mean, football, say. Football gets that too. I watch yeah. basketball and I'm just like, slow, man, though. they it's just really keep running. Yeah. That's. I'd be dead five minutes in. They just keep running. There's a, There's too much squeaking. But you say you say football slow, but baseball. <laughs> I think baseball. If you were to take the time where the baseball is actually in play, a normal baseball game will last like three hours. Yeah. The actual time the ball's in play is like eleven minutes. I would say, in terms of like comparing football to baseball, the actual gameplay of baseball is really slow, right? Like yeah. when you actually think about it. But like yeah. football, the gameplay is very fast paced, and there's a lot and going on. But what there's I will so say, much between yeah. it. Like what I will say so about football shit. is, even if you're not scoring goals, it's American like, football. Or American something. football. Not soccer, football. Not football. At least in football, though, even if nothing happens, it's like, oh, that guy got hit hard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's fun to watch. Oh, he broke his neck. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, but then you have that in basketball too. Like when somebody runs up and just fucking dunks on somebody and sticks yep. their dick in his face, and the guy's like, oh, or when a guy dunks and then his leg snaps in half. Yeah, that's, oh. just happening that's been happening or more often. Shoe blows out. Like, shoe blows out. <laughs> Damn, dude. 
Oh, watch out for that. Water polo. Basketball is the most intense sport. Feel free yeah. to disagree, but that's how I feel. Basketball is well, I have basketball. no, I just don't value my opinion in any way because I don't watch anything. I would say so. football and basketball, in my opinion. I enjoy so. watching football. I probably, I'm, having, I'm, I probably I like football. Sports, but I just like watching well, okay, I probably I, like football the least. I, in I, will, I will say, mm -hmm. in person, basketball is amazing. I think baseball is the best sport in person. Uh, baseball baseball's really good. Baseball is good in person. person. Baseball is a lot better in person than it is on TV. Football on TV is better than being there in the stadium, in my opinion. In, I, I agree. In person, if you're close enough, though, Quidditch is very exciting. <laughs> you can you can see the snitch, and you're like, get it, get it, get it. You say that. They just yeah. had the Quidditch World Cup in Round Rock. Right, were they flying? Uh, no, it's, it's college kids running around. Yeah. The fucking sticks between yeah. their legs. You learn to fly. You and I know. Watch it's, it. a, it's what it it's is. A, it's a legit thing. They actually. You might, motherfucking my start went to flying, it. and I'll come watch the goddamn and show. And so, like, it's it's funny though. I want to see the. Believe it or not, the, there's not a lot of Quidditch teams that compete in the World Cup. What? But there are some colleges. There's I think three. like I think Duke has one. <laughs> I think USC has one. What's the? And these teams come out and they'll play against like these guys who don't give a shit. And these college teams will destroy these teams. What's it's, the it's fuck amazing. you ball? Snitch? Oh, the, the, uh, snitch? the bludger? Blood, oh, is the bludger? The, 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 the bludger. quaffle. It's something the quaffle. Like the quaffle. The, quaffle no, 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 the bludgers and the beaters. The, the, the bludgers are the ones you get, like, get hit with. That's yeah, what I'm talking about. That's a bludger. The quaffle is what you score with. Yes. Okay. Yeah, I'm all about the fuck you balls. Like, I'm just going to hit you with a bowling ball. <laughs> Bam! <laughs> And they're like, ah, they're when, 10. So are the, co are the coaches on the sideline doing a little, like, casting a little spell? Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. he's well, you see, you see Snape doing yeah. the spell, but turns out it was a counter oh, yeah. curse. We got the sports ball logo up for you. Why? Go. Bring Get it back. Get out of here. <laughs> Bring it back. <laughs> Get it out of here right now. This is in uh, off that's topic. Like, that's like canceled. a black spot. Right. Like pirate oh, apparently <laughs> someone wants me dead. Yeah, the Kraken's coming. Thanks. <laughs> no, um, when I was really young, uh, I was like with my cousin. We were in my garage like looking for, you know, whatever, a football or something. And I had this little plastic bat. It was like this big and like a brown baseball bat. And and I was like, what the fuck is this thing? Because it was like so tiny. And my cousin's like, oh, that looks like a Quidditch bat. And he picks up a basketball and he goes, here comes the bludger. And he threw it at me and the bat bent as it hit it. <laughs> and it hit my bike and every single shelf in my garage came down from that. That's awesome. <laughs> my cousin looked at me for a second, turned and ran out of the house. That's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> I'd watch that sport. Yeah, that's a good sport. If you fucked up, it's quite a, sport. do you bean people with bludgers? Yeah, I think like, so. Like, like, like yeah. the, you know, when you go bowling and you do the tent, like use the tiny balls, yeah, yeah, the yeah, giant yeah, ones. Are those the? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It's like that. But oh, it should be. Balls. They're dodgeballs. Yeah. Okay, there you go. Raw, uh, no, it but but be. then but they then, should be cannonballs. But the snitch they're, they're is, and it's funny because the snitch is just a dude wearing yellow who runs and he's got like like uh Ours? like and like, he stiff arms people on the ground. Well, no, wait, he, he's that. got he's got like uh like the flag football <gasps> flags on him yeah. and if, oh. whoever catches him catches the snitch. But yeah, it's literally guys just running around the field and only the chasers can get him. There you go. <laughs> yeah, here's here's the, some clips. Give of the me World a Cup. broom and a taser and I'll get that snitch. <laughs> Guaranteed. That's a fucking sport, right? That it's a taser. Look, football? look at him struggling oh, yeah, to find something happening. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There, there it is. is. There yeah, so here you go. Here's some quidditch. You look were at watching. the structural integrity of those hoops. Fly, Fly you dumb shit. They're not even broom. Fly. The sticks. Uh, yeah. So well, you know, look I don't at know. The ref, the ref that, that, that ref's doing community service. Yeah. Right there. She got a DUI, and they were yeah, like, "Yeah, good throw." They it's not even like, between his legs. He's just running. There you go. There's a snitch right there. It's a snitch on his pants. It's his anus. Look at his gut. Look at his gut. It says snitch Come on his on. pants, so you know what he's a snitch. Is this? Come on now. What? That's crazy. It's chilled. He, that was a joke. <laughs> he was like, yeah, my favorite part is when they try to grab the snitch, but I turn around and they grab my balls. Yeah. <laughs> That's my favorite part. What the fuck? That dude yeah. had. Why does that exist? That was. It's absurd. a thing. It's a thing that exists. What I just saw. And the, and the world the guy the such championship a is here cut. in Round Rock, just north of Austin. Dude, the he's all mad. The snitch is all mass. You've seen the movies. Yeah. <laughs> what? Holy people away. Hell. Anyway, hey Michael. Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you tell me about the next ad read? I'm gonna tell you about this okay. video game. It's called Devil May Cry. 5. Devil May Cry oh, Five. That's it's, a good one. Uh, it's a big one. It's a popular one right now. This episode of Off Talk was brought to you by Devil May Cry Five, an over-the-top action-filled game rated M for mature, available on Xbox One. Devil May Cry Returns plays Dante, Nero, and the mysterious new protagonist V. Ever need to just slice and dice demons while looking hella nice? This is the game for you. It features three demon hunters, each with unique play styles. Don't just destroy em enemies. Do it with style and sick skills. Dante has a range of weapons with varying styles. But uh, I'm all about V, who controls a bird and a panther at the same time while reading poetry. 
So, you know, get your Shakespearean on. But don't just take our word for it. Bleeding Cool calls it an elegant symphony of obliteration. Dual Shockers call it one hell of a good time. And Game Rant called Devil May Cry 5 the perfect action game. So come and kick some demon ass with Devil May Cry 5. And remember, games play best on Xbox One. Don't miss out. Get Devil May Cry 5 now to play on Xbox One. There's lots of chopping, there's lots of slashing. Stylish is a big thing. You want to get S rank in that game. I put God knows how many hours in Devil May Cry 4. And it's just like, you got to mix your combos together. You've got your, your Nero had like his, his gun. I don't remember. When did his S devil, devil trigger. When did S rank become above A? Like Long time ago. Long time ago. Long, I mean, like, long, you think, long, What was the first you game? Grades, you get an A. That and had an the best. I'm just saying, if you got an S grade, if I, if I, yeah, what's, if what's I was in college, and then and then a lot of games, and I think Devil May Cry does this. You can get like S, double S, or triple S. Yeah. That's just like pfft, what's you the can't touch what's me. the first game to have an S rank in it? I don't know. The first game I remember. I feel like it would be a Capcom. The game. The first game I remember, um, which certainly wasn't the first game, but the first game I remember was, was Final Fantasy game. VII, because you could get an S rank Chocobo, which was ninety seven. I mean, okay. it certainly existed before that. I think that was the first game I played where I'm like Fatal Fury Special. Fatal Fury Special. Thank you. I was looking it up. On oh, what console? Is it uh, Neo Nintendo? Geo. What was it? Neo Geo. Shit. Oh my god. Is that a real thing? Man. Talk about consoles. I, you see, we still have the Mortal Kombat. I wanted, I wanted a Neo Geo. Oh, so I, play, I, Dude, I, I played fun. so Ford much it. Devil May Cry 4. Metal Slug. Devil May Cry 4 had a, um, like a fuck you challenge mode which was clear a hundred floors of enemies and there was like no saving Jesus in between Christ. so it was like time based where you start and you only have like three minutes but then depending on how well you build your combos you've got oh, yeah. more time so inevitably the time became irrelevant like you couldn't do well enough to beat it and not have enough time mm -hmm. but i mean it was like to, to beat the whole thing maybe like an hour and a half two hours jesus and uh i got it, it was like 100 floors, 100 floors, 100 floors. And there was like a number of achievements attached to it because it was on the 360. And I beat floor 100 and I'm like, got it. And floor 101 was Dante, who's like the main protagonist mm -hmm. of every game before that. And I was just like, I panicked. I was like, oh, 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 oh. And, he, and, he, and I died. Oh. At, at floor 101, I died and I put the game away. <laughs> I was just like, you killed me out of this game. So it was like one of your first rage quits. You're like, I'm, I'm, it done. Wasn't, I'm not playing it It again. wasn't even rage. It yeah. was just like, you've crushed me. Have you had a legit rage quit I got to floor while? 101. I, um, I had a rage quit recently in a Minecraft thing I was doing, and I, I literally stopped. I was like, Jack I'm had done. a legitimate rage I'm quit out. in Cops and Crooks. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I heard about funny. that. I, I know, I kept yeah. playing until we were done with the video, kind well, of. Well, you rage played. Um, God, well, somebody asked for doing more of VR The Champions. What an interesting time to ask. I think The answer is no. I right, thought we were right. talking we're about setting it. Something there's, we're yeah, looking, there's, there's, we just got the fire. Yeah, stay tuned. We were there's definitely looking yes. into that. The answer is yes. Yeah, we're doing more of that. Age um, versus Funhouse Quidditch match. Dante <laughs> Bosco's in front of him. I would play that. <laughs> Dante Bosco. I got the floor 101! Oh. It killed me! How long did that take? <sighs> Probably almost two hours. Hour and a half, hour Ooh. 45. No checkpoints. It's just like... That's rough. Like, and I mean, I died a number of times on like floor 70. Oh. Floor 75, but like the furthest I made it was like 60 or 70 and on this run I just like I did everything I beat it all I'm like what and I'm like yeah, and then I even paused it and like I'm shaking I'm like looking up strategies like how to beat this guy and Dante just put his sword right up my ass He just beat the shit out of me. I'll do it. Um, Nero, Voice of Nero, Johnny and Bosch. Just throwing that out there. I like him. He's Black Power Ranger. Second Black Power Ranger. Also Vash the Stampede. That was his first anime gig and I liked it a lot. New Sea of Thieves content coming out I'm this done. week, right? We've been talking a lot. No, no, it just, yeah. just came out already. So, also, the out. raft has a bunch here, of new here's content. A, here's the cool thing about Sea of Thieves. Like, it a make huge raft giant update just came out. But since we've played it, there's been like five. Oh, yeah. Wow. There's been like a little one, little one, little one, little one. And this is essentially like the year two update. Okay. So Matt like, and Trevor play the game constantly. The problem with Matt is time. though, Matt and Larry and Trevor like play it all the time anyway. Right. So like Losers. they yeah. add like a grain of sand and they're like, there's a reason to go back. There's new sand. And it's like, yeah, great, whatever. But now, like, there's like six updates worth I mean, of shit. Listen. So like I'm I'm actually excited. My I I've had a little bit of rest. Short beard, I think, peg I think, packer, oh, two peg, legs, we will, navigator jack. We will definitely do lazy. maybe I won't throw up um, in the lazy. middle of the video. 
Oh, that's right. You threw up in the video. I almost did. I, yeah. I got lightheaded. It was the Kraken. I'm like, there's a Kraken! And I was like screaming. And then, and then, Michael and then sat there eating Slim Jims. I had to stop. I don't remember what it was. It was Slim Jims or something else. It was a Slim because you had no food that day. No, so you were just something munching. Else. It was something else. Cheez Its. Cheez Its. That's yep. what it was. I grabbed a box of Cheez Its and I started shoving Cheez Its into my mouth. Because I was starting to black out. <laughs> like, <laughs> literally. Not, not drink water, I'm just not, I'm not Jesus. kidding. Like, I can tell. I get that, like, cold sweats. Like, yeah. I've had it before with, like, getting needles and blood drawn and shit. And I was just like... And I just pushed my microphone away. And I just started eating <laughs> And Gavin's like, Michael's eating cheese. And I'm just standing on the ship. I was like, eating her and Peck be having a lot of it trouble. It was <laughs> bad, dude. It was bad, but I think I'm ready. I'm, I'm a little bit rested, and then Peg Pecker's ready to come back. So there you go. You'll definitely have more Sea of Thieves. You'll definitely have more Raft. You'll definitely have more World War Z whenever Gavin comes back to America. And there was something we're else people VR. were just asking we're about. VR, the VR the champions. champions. We're going to do that Borderlands stream oh, at pe some point. People are asking about Seven Days to Die coming back. I, man, I don't know. I've been looking at that game in a long time. Yeah, I, I've been, been real I've sick said, of restarting I've that been keeping, game. I've been keeping an eye on it. Like They've been updating and stuff, but I'm, I'm waiting for like a big, like, all right, it, it's stable. A big like, Sea yeah. of Thieves update. Um, no hurry, but someone maybe asked, someday. Someone actually asked about Trials, too. Gavin and I want to do some stuff in the new Trials game. There's the... There's yeah. the, uh, the uh, uh, not Segway bike. Fuck, what's the word I'm looking for? We don't know. Tandem, tandem. tandem bike. There's the tandem bike. Two players oh. on one bike. Oh, so I want to uh, trials double dash. I think we had a stream yeah. in there or something. So, yeah, we'll do that. We think also, gonna... Minecraft. Yeah, Minecraft. let us know about that Minecraft got... 102. Well, Here's the thing. If you want us to so do a Minecraft 102. We do in Minecraft right We got, we got ideas still doing Minecraft. You're Dead, You're Dead. We've done Wipeout now. We Sky Factory, Sky Factory, we, Sky we, Factory need to do. we have some like ideas. Adding for in that. this achievement thing is like that's a lot. We got, I, a lot of Minecraft we got a Minecraft. I mean, and the reason I need it. Need it. <laughs> the reason <laughs> I found out about, about the Minecraft 102 stuff is because I loaded up Minecraft to make a Let's Play the other day. I was gonna make an old school Jeff and Gavin style. Just I was just gonna go through the menus, find stuff, and come up with no an idea creative? for a game. Just find all uh, the blocks. Well, no, I would do it in creative. Duplication, but, glitch with the far Yeah, but uh. But then I got distracted by the achievements and went on that front. But yeah, we got a lot of. I think, lot. I think if we got Minecraft is a bit, having a bit of a renaissance yeah, as a as a streaming and YouTube platform right now yeah. in itself. Anyway, yeah. I think if we got li it's literally printed game. out the it achievements, is. like literally got sheets and we start checking them off, yeah. like, that would be the way to do it. Like if we had a big thing on the wall, and we yeah. just like. Shh. And would it be something well, where we, we all go for like, this? Would we all go for the same one, or would we all split up and like help each other? I, like, I'm going to so be in charge of these. I'm, I, see, I, I never formulated an idea. Like, is the goal for idea. all of us to get 100? Is the goal for one person get all 100? Everybody to get like all 102? Like if Jeff or gets all 102. Person. Or if it's a race or what. But I would be awesome if everybody could get it yeah. together. That's so many. Yeah. But it's a lot. So maybe we'll do one person. That's also a pain in the ass. Remember when we were doing the Wither one and we had, we ended up having to kill the Wither like three times because yeah. some people got killed and were too far away too far for away, to count. Yeah. And yeah. Like, but that also makes thing. for funny. To make sure that one person gets all 100, 102. Just Truffles. seeing that accomplishment. Yeah. yeah. There's a bunch of Jackbox games I've ever played that like look through. I love Jackbox. you like pointing, like lying and trying to lie amongst your friends. I was just playing trivial, trivia murder party. I was playing that game. Yeah. Um, and like I'm still, I've played that game probably close to a hundred times now. I'm still getting questions I haven't seen. Yeah. Like, and and then like the death games are always different. You just don't know what. I played that happen. with my mom and Millie a while back, and it was pretty the death fucking games. Fun. fun. It was just fun. Yeah, that and I think it was Fibbage I played. It was great games. Alfredo's mm. fine. No, he's dead inside. He's fat. I died a lot. I died during. <laughs> Jack, you, <laughs> Jack, fat, you fuck. fat fuck. <laughs> Seven, Seven days that I seventy point one stable. We were Sorry, <laughs> fans. Jesus Christ. We were Holy shit. A good, wow, that was aggressive. We were laughing Shat a good forty in. minutes ago. I feel like, and it was like. It was like, Alfredo's so fat, Jack looks thin. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> that was a good Jackie, one. Jackie, in the comments, that was swat. funny. <laughs> what is that from? What is that? It's awful. It's like, uh, bad TV. No, no, it was Saturday Night Live. It was Wait, Jamie, Jamie, Jane, you ignorant slut. Jane, that's oh, it. Oh, really? It's Jane, also from you the office. ignorant slut. Yeah, yeah Dwight, that's you a, ignorant slut. That's a, that's a callback to the Chevy Chase, Jane, Chevy Chase, yeah, and Jane, yeah. Chevy Chase. So funny. That's from season, like, two. Well, the first five seasons had Chevy, right? So, or four seasons. That's from the 70s. All right, back when Garrett. Jack, was oh, oh hey, hardcore, hardcore tabletop. Hardcore tabletop. That's a what show. That? That's Give me a little reminder. Uh, episode four just came out this week. Oh, oh, it's how, a many, good one. how many are there? Is there don't eight? look at the thumbnail because the thumbnail is a fucking spoiler. I don't know. Put you that don't together. Nope. For what? We don't know. The the thumbnail for this episode that no. just came out. It's a pretty pretty big spoiler. No. Uh, so just watch it. Don't look at the thumbnail. I don't know how many get, episodes there are. I'm gonna guess there's like six to eight. Yeah, but, it's, it's, um, it's at least six, maybe eight. There's uh, shit's getting rolling. Oh um, right, it's really fun. A episode bunch of four just came out. I was sheriffing so hard this episode. 
Uh, yeah. The, Jeff, you have something to say? Jeff. People are asking if you're going to do a 50 turn Mario Party this year. I've seen that come up a bunch in chat today. Yeah. Calm down. All right, yeah, I think it's the do same party. I said it was this Calm year. Down. Do you, do you, do you do understand how we talk about how much Gavin is in the June office? Yet. You think he's around to shoot four fucking hours of Mario Party? Yeah. Like, chill the fuck out, man. And I want him Calm for down. World War Z, goddammit. Good lord. I, I, I literally didn't tell Michael because I'm one of those guys where the more I see someone post the same thing, the less inclined I am. To I'm the same way. Yeah. I'm the same yeah. way. If you can't shut the fuck up, then I'm not going to answer yeah. you. I just didn't. I'm not exactly. What is my favorite brand of shoe? But, like, good lord. Calm down. Is it a Did you see those pants? We're going to sit and play a game and it's going to come out. I don't. I don't recall the, when the setting the that stretch have 45 goal. Pairs of. I don't recall setting the stretch goal and saying guaranteed it'll be out by oh. this day. Did you see the Thanos? Chill out, Adidas? man. It'll be out. Oh, they're pretty awesome. Looking. I gotta get Gavin, like Meg, and Lindsay one. together. Yeah, also, really cool. also like the whole beginning of the year, like Lindsay had a fucking baby. Like, oh, yeah. chill the yeah. fuck out. That's a whole thing. Get there. And we did a fucking tour in Australia. Good and we Lord. did a we filmed the whole second season of Haunter. Yep. It's been a pretty busy year so far. Busy and a second season of or and we did hardcore tabletop World Series. I will say, which sucks. And we're starting. Like a new series pretty soon. I'll throw yeah. it out now, oh, though, just yeah. because Double, like yeah, so. I don't want to get people's hopes up or expectations or whatever. What sucks we is two I, new series. So. I was only I was only able to do one. Oh. It's fine. I was only able to do one episode mm -hmm. of Haunter mm -hmm. this season, and yeah. Lindsay is not in it. Yeah, it's oh, sad. Yeah. It sucks, yeah. but listen. Timing. Baby. Stop having babies. Baby. That's Timing. Your damn and fault. you know, had to, to do the kids. There was one episode. You get a that cat. Lindsay, you could have had it. You could have been in Haunter. Lindsay was supposed we to be get, in it, baby. but it ended up falling through. I was in an episode which might be two parts. Oh, so was it, it Dan Aykroyd that said Jane? Where you was stuck? such a place? Oh, no. I know which one you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it was. I was told you're right. It wasn't Chase. Chase. It wasn't Yeah, you're right. You're right. I apologize. Sorry about that. She super wanted to be in it, but, you know, baby. Bag of glass. It's a bag of glass. Kids love it. It's glass. It's shiny. I'll chew some glass. We, um, eat, we eat in glass. Jack, can you take us to Taco Bell? Oh my, that was that was wet. He farted. That Jeff was farted. Jeff I thought farted. that was. Jeff oh my god, it sounded like <laughs> it was, was on a seat. Oh, Jeff farted. Dude, go. Jeff, it was wet. All right, it was wet. Let's get out of here. Well, thanks for watching. We We're need a mop. The show, and then Jack's gonna Jeff take just shit Jeremy himself on Bell. camera. We gotta take right. care of something uh, real fast. I'm gonna go. Charge for tabletop. Do we have a clip? Yeah. Oh, we got a Play clip. the fucking clip. Play us out. Jeff, shit the room. Run the clip. Don't spoil it. Might be spoiler. Oh my god. <laughs> you don't want to go out this way. Give me a thousand dollars. You gotta give it to me. Give me a thousand dollars. 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 The hostage situation was barbaric. It's not surprising at all to see Bruce do this. He's a piece of shit. This only happened to me twice before when I was refereeing the eight to 12 year old soccer games. Uh, both times ended up pretty poorly. Everyone across the table, they're freaking out. Oh my God, guy's got a gun. Did an ocular pat down of the subject, realized that he had a firearm and decided to quickly and immediately incapacitate. And I cried, I weeped, you know, I put my coat on him.